Hey guys, how's it going? Um, my hair is doing really, really weird things today, so I'm going to be upset with it all night, and that's okay. Uh, but yeah, we're going to be playing some gas station simulator. We are going to be trying out the new Tidal Wave DLC, um, and we kindly got the game from the publishers through Keymailer, so thank you very much for the key for this game. There we go. Add it to my wish list? What? What do you mean? <laughs> Don't I don't I own it? Oh my goodness. I'm confused. Is Tidal Wave a completely different Wait. Why does it say new game Tidal Wave, new game and then continue? Oh, oh no. What does this mean? I'm confused. Do I have to start a new game? I do not understand. Condiment surfaces! Oh my goodness. Coming in for the tier 1 sub for 30 months! Thank you so much. I appreciate you, friend. Hope wow. Well. Wow. Yes, indeed. Hey, Correct. Listen. Correct. No comply, Nick. Thanks for the follow. Welcome. Hey, do we- are we supposed to start a new save for this? I just, I want to get right into it, and I'm not entirely sure. Okay. Join us on a live stream, stay up to date. I'm very confused. New location, new save, I guess so. Yeah, let's just try it then. Hop on new game. Thank you, Jim. Hi, Coco. How you doing? That's interesting. I thought it was going to be like um, a part of the old game still. Is motion blur on? Oh my god, it is. Stop. <laughs> Options, what is it? This, ah, la la la, graphic. Is it just me or is this game like not running very well? Hold on, lens flare. We'll leave that, motion blur off. I'll leave everything else on for now. Um, It should be a lot better without the motion blur, I think. Oh. Is that a bobblehead? Dude, even the... I don't know, the cinematics are chugging a little... It's weird! Is that me? Okay, welcome to Tidal Wave. Uh, you will have the opportunity to develop a new business on a paradise island. The island is ruled by a mysterious god named Chun Chu Man Chun Chu Manchu. <laughs> In the physical form of a volcano, being on the island, you are subject to his anger. So it's basically like my uncle, but in volcano form then. So try to live in harmony with him as to not cause any unnecessary escalation, terrain conditions, and ubiquitous, ubiquitous water open up possibilities for entirely new vehicles and activities. Be attentive to discover them all during the game, have fun, and watch out for the dangers of the new world. Aloha. Find the generator and turn on the power. That's not the generator. Let me know, guys, if I need to turn up the volume, by the way. Okay, this is really neat. This is like a completely different world, which I think, like, Personally, I needed this. Are my settings generally on full epic? Yep, usually. I mean, I'm running at 60 frames per second now. It's just a weird loading screen. Okay. Generator. On. The generator turns on the torches. I'm- oh my goodness, Gerardus. I know, right? Can we sacrifice chat to the volcano? <laughs> it's step, turn, step, pivot. Are you trying to piss off the volcano? <laughs> Volume seems fine. Let me know if I need to turn it up. 
Um, I actually can't hear it very well, but that might be a me problem. Take a gift for Chunchu Manchu. What's the fill of a cruise ship? Yeah, I'm running at mostly 60 frames per second. Oh, fishy fish. Watch the fish. What is this called? Refuel boats. Uh, Dust Bowl. Calm Chunchu Manchu by offering him a gift. Shark bait. Ooh ha ha. Um. Did anyone get my Family Guy reference, by the way? Did no one get that? <laughs> can we. Oh my goodness. Can we please get that as a Tangia thing? Like. A redeem. The altar is a place where you can make a sacrifice to the powerful Chunchu Manchu. By interacting with the cauldron located at the top of the altar, you can offer him gifts that will reduce his anger. The coconut dispenser available in front of the altar can also be used to calm him. Throwing coconuts into the cauldron from one of these three fields will reduce the god's anger. Okay. Really creepy. Um, can I? Does this hurt? No, this does. <laughs> First thing Ultrasaurus does stand in lava. Is this okay? Sacrificial gift. Yeah, there you go. The island is. Uh, okay, hold on. The island is ruled by Chenji Manchu. Volcano at the top of the screen shows the god's current anger. The anger grows spontaneously and can be increased or decreased depending on your actions. If the a anger indicator fills up, the volcano will erupt, causing a number of problems. <laughs> be careful or your paradise island might turn into hell on Earth. Great. Great, we love that. We gotta clean up the gas station. Thank you, Coastal. Don't forget to walk without rhythm. <laughs> Joe versus the volcano. Oh, I bet you they have another like annoying kid in this game. Like what's his face? No, ah, that didn't hit. Player, this doesn't look like a very fancy gas station at all. This gas station attendant jobs descriptions gotta go crazy. I know, right? Yeah, literally TLDR, fill up gas and also appease the volcano and don't piss it off. That's a lot. That's a lot to be asking for. In my opinion. Okay. Build the warehouse. Use the upgrades tab on the PC to do it. We got fish. Upgrades. Warehouse. Yes, please. Oh, what's this cute music? Hi, Trey Rider. How you doing? Yeah, Dennis. Right. I forgot what his name was. Those are perfectly good barrels? Question mark says Fizerp. <laughs> I have, oh my god, I have like a little baby hair here. It's just driving me nuts. Okay. Next up, order 100 liters of fuel. You can do it using the delivery tab on your PC. Clean the warehouse. Clean this out too. <laughs> Those are perfectly good barrels. Okay, Fazer. Where is my warehouse? Oh, it's over here. Oh, I didn't even pay attention to the cinematic. I was like, I don't even know where this is. Is there a boat coming in? There is. Clean out the, oh my God, what is this? It's like oral? Oral? That kills people. Uh, like, yeah, that's sp sponge. I feel like these would do better in the ocean, right? Like, not just tossing them there, but whatever, it's fine. Whatever the game wants. 
I kind of want to leave the fish for now. <laughs> Aesthetic fish. Okay. Neat. Oh, this is really cool, guys. I actually, you know what? I'm going to be really honest with you guys. I'm actually really glad that this is a separate map and a separate save. Because I did like my old store, but I, I did feel like I was getting a little tired of it. And it felt like it was becoming a little bit too much. Like all the, like the airport. Oh, no. no. <laughs> Coral. I thought someone was crying in game. I was like, what is going on? Who is crying in my game? When delivery arrives, you need to turn on the valve to be supplied with fuel. Uh, oh my god, it's all the- how do we- Go over here? Everything is so... What the heck? Alright, here we go! <laughs> okay. They've given me the gas. Open the gas station for the customers. We can do that. Uh. Player charges too much for fuel. Volcano. And I took that personally. <laughs> Literally. Oh, uh, repeat. I don't remember what I was talking about. I feel like I need more context than that. Coral. Can you ride a piece of wood to the moon like on the OG map? I don't even know how you did that to begin with, dude. So like... Oh. The game doesn't like it when you do that, by the way. Oh no! It's not taking us back! <laughs> Jesus. That was almost a tragedy. Wait until the customers arrive and then refuel the boats. Oh, do I have to refuel all the way out here, though? Oh, no, I gotta do it here. Okay. Give me your boats. Oh, there's a boat here. How do I... Where does this go? What goes in there? And then, oops. Oh, right, I got, I did not give him any gas. He's gonna run out of gas like right there. You can do the same on a fish? Oh my God. He says something after. Oh, I don't remember what I said. Sorry, I, I wish I paid more attention to what I said, but I, I don't, I just say things and then they promptly leave my brain after. It would help if I actually thought about like what I talked about on screen. Do we need another customer? Because the, the game was not happy with how I refueled that. Also, my stomach's hurting again? Uh-oh. Not good. Um, are we going to get more customers, maybe? Oh, here we go! How do I speed up the, the press shift? Oh, there we go. Yeah. Buy a parking lot. I have to do that with the computer. Am I still peeing blood? No. Saturday, what an atrocious thing to say in chat with zero context. There's gonna be new people here in stream and they're gonna be like, is she dying? Is she, is she well? How could that possibly be a joke? Um, I'm 
complete the challenge to unlock new gas station. Okay, so we gotta fuel boats and serve customers, but... Okay. <laughs> Jim King's like, I Okay. Get out of here. Don't I need things to sell in my store to serve customers? Like... <laughs> Okay, um, so I would need to buy features, gel, snacks. Everybody likes a good snack. Let's buy the big one because we can. And then soft, serve, soft drink, do that too. Um, I don't know how to access this stuff. in stock why don't i remember how to do this tools buy a broom buy a trash bag upgrades management oh my god no i don't have things to sell to you sir oh i think i go to tab oh there we go that's how we do it right food stand uh rotate Didn't they have an update recently where they, like, they have, like, snap to... Press R to activate snapping. Oh my god, there we go. Um, we have that. Uh, I think I heard another boat coming, so we gotta deal with that, too. I feel like, you know what? I, I think if, like, Supermarket Simulator had, like, a similar, um, pace to this game and automation i feel like it would be a lot better but unfortunately it, it doesn't it's just it's there's zero automation in it jwo oh my god dude coming in with the 26 month sub dude i appreciate you thank you so much how you doing it's good to see you holy guacamole 26 months my dude my dude i swear if there's a dentist i'm gonna beat that kid up With all due respect. Ew, this is so dirty. Uh, we need to purchase snack. Right? How do I buy snacks? I don't remember. Services? Employees. Delivery. Products. Deliveries are now on water. You don't need to care about the gate. The warehouse is always open. That means boat people can steal my stuff. Okay, let's, uh, let's do that. Oops, uh, we'll get rid of that then. Okay. So gas station was bringing in Waterland? Yeah, dude, it's awesome. I'm having a lot of fun. Uh, we do need to order more fuel, though. I think it would be nice if, like, fuel could be automated. To I'm sure there is a way to automate it where it just automatically is ordered for you. I don't like having to do this over and over again. Not the biggest fan. This is so scummy. <laughs> Oi. Do we put the fish somewhere nice? Like, I just, I feel like it's not... <gasps> we put the fish back in the water? I just don't feel like it's very nice to throw the fish away. And I just... Be free! Bro. That's totally a thing, right? Wait, what's the point of using the garbage cans if I can just toss all of my crap back into the- Oh my god, wait. Guys, this is a strat. This is actually a strat. Why am I using the garbage can? Return to the ocean! 
Yeah, it's a whole new map. I've been alright, I've been alright. Oh, barnacles. Yeah, literally. All I'm saying is there doesn't seem to be any consequence for me doing this right now, right? Like, I could probably throw garbage in there too. Oh. Okay, that pisses off the volcano. <laughs> Okay, we're figuring things out, chat. <laughs> Big man, you know what? I bet you. Do you think if we? Do you think if we garbage the fish, that he gets mad too? Probably, right? Step, turn, step, pivot. What did I do? I threw crap into the water. <laughs> Be free. Yeah, I, I guarantee you guys, I guarantee you that um, if we threw the fish into the garbage, the volcano is going to get really mad. Do we want to see and find out what happens when we take off the volcano? Who wants to find out? Wow, unfollow. Jim King says yes. I have a feeling Jim King knows exactly what happens. I think he knows exactly what happens if the volcano's ticked off, dude. Okay, well, firstly, let's just empty our garbage. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on. Um, We're going to take this stuff and we're going to... Yeet. Do not pollute in the ocean. Okay. Whatever, mom. Are we getting big bad? I'm going to go in here and we are going to tell the computer, hey, um, if you could please. No, nope, not what I wanted. How do I tell it? Ooh, garbage collection. So if we do that, right? If we do that, I'm just wondering. No, so the volcano doesn't get. Well, maybe we'll find out. Because we have a lot of ocean fugu stuff in that trash can. So I feel like the volcano will get really mad if we. Um... Where do you get gas? Holy guacamole, Raptor Raptoria coming up the raid, party of 33. Welcome, welcome, raiders. Hope you guys are all doing well. It's good to see you. How are you guys playing? If we can get a quick shout out for Raptor, I would really appreciate that. How are you doing? What were you playing? Please tell us a little about your stream. If you guys don't know who I am, welcome. My name is Ultrasaurus. I am a mixed race uh, Canadian streamer who plays a lot of simulation games. Uh, we are playing the new DLC for Gas Station, and it is a lot of fun. It is fantastic. It is great. Uh, we are currently in the process of pissing off the volcano right now. Big maybe. You were also playing Gas Station Sim. Were you, were you playing the DLC as well? Thank you so much for coming in with the lovely raid, by the way. I really do appreciate you. Um, there's so much garbage. Okay, we're gonna continue doing things to make the, the volcano mad. Because I want to see what happens. We're very early game, so I feel like we can successfully tick him off and, and not suffer, like, big consequences for it. Yeah, welcome, Raiders. Hope you guys are all doing well. I don't know if you guys are caught in an ad or what have you, but don't pollute in the ocean. <laughs> doing it. Ocean be damned. He's still, he wow, he takes a lot to actually get mad, eh? How about how you doing? Good to see you. I don't know. Okay, wait, wait, okay. Is he Oh, he's too away from being mad. Hold on, this'll do it. <laughs> Woo! He mad?
Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> hey, people are not happy. There's a lot of screaming. Kodo, I didn't say I didn't say mixed species, my dude. Who's screaming? The the people. So does he eventually calm down or do I need to oh I might need to calm him down myself. Okay, we gotta find coconuts or something. Like that was that's that was the strat earlier, right? Oh no, he's chill. He's chill. He's good. He cooled off. He's happy. Island people suffering for your pollution in, in, in so many different ways. In so many different ways. Which is like the funny part. Fishy, fishy, good boys. In the water. Dang. Uh, yeah, it looks like it just put some rocks in the parking lot. I don't know. That didn't seem all that dramatic, other than the the townsfolk that were probably getting murdered by the rock. I don't know. Kind of seems like an ish, ish them. Not an ish me. Ish you. I thought I ordered to get the garbage taken out, didn't I? I have no customers. Why do I not have any customers? Come buy my stuff, guys. Please. I like how they have these convenient windows for fish shooting. Yep. You know, well, volcano isn't that bad. <laughs> yeah, it's okay to throw fishy, fishy good boys and coral back into the water. I think it's actually a good thing. I think if you actually throw them out, I think that's when the game might get upset with you. This is open, right? We had like one customer that one time and now we don't have anyone. Reptoria, are you in here or any of your raiders in here? I I don't think I've spookiest raid. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> I hope you guys are doing well. You guys are okay. First impressions are everything. Are you saying I scared everybody off? <laughs> Can you sacrifice them to the choo choo? To the volcano? Uh, probably not. I don't think the volcano wants fish. Maybe we don't have customers because it's so dirty. Like, I kind of doubt it, but... Also, I love how we're on a beach and it's like, yeah, try not to track sand in here. Like, bro, what do you mean? Pretty, pretty clean. Kind of nice. I don't know. I would maybe shop here. Probably not, but maybe. That's my boat fueling. Oops. Due to the volcano, it's a travel hazard. <laughs> oh, maybe because I completely ruined my- Oh my god. Can these go into the water? I don't think this is polluting, right? Right? It came from the volcano, it's natural. He's fine, he's cool with that, he's cool with that. Oh my god. You know what? It might have scared some customers away. I don't think you're completely wrong. 
Why does it sound like a gunshot is going off? You think I can hit the ocean from here? <laughs> Woo! Okay. I, I swear I can hear a car. Yeah, maybe the road is blocked from, like, elsewhere. I score from doing what? Oh, from shooting the garbage into the... Okay. I'm here for the raid, just lurking? I appreciate the lurk, thank you. The Beast Easter, how you doing? Jack gas station throwing boulders around might be scaring the customers away. I think you're wrong. I think it's fine. Oh, you know what? Maybe I have to turn this... Is this... I think I found the problem. Calm down! Jesus! Sir, where are you getting out? <laughs> it's just screaming. I think they'll sort themselves out. Drive. Drive. Go. Go. Screaming, just just absolute screaming. She's still going. Are you okay? She's still screaming. Can you sweep a car into the ocean? Probably. I think that'll really tick off the volcano, though. Like, out of all the things that we could possibly be doing, that'll probably... Honest to God, even this garbage truck coming in is gonna probably very much upset the volcano, too, because, uh... How do I do this? Um... Garbage bag? Yeah, it's gonna really upset the... the the volcano because uh, I have fish and coral in the garbage. People are coming in though. Nice. That thing you just garbage bag? What was that? I don't even know, dude. I don't even know. It looked kind of meaty though. I. Yay, customers. Bok going to make some food and Raptor changed into an attractive woman. Oh, is Raptor a guy? <laughs> hey, John, how you doing? It's good to see you. Welcome to the stream. You. Did you buy something? Oh, I forgot about how annoying this minigame is. You're amazing. You're amazing. Yeah, I got you, homie. I got you. So we want to probably buy some more stuff. Hey, listen. Can I buy all that? Triple, <laughs> triple clown threat. Thanks for the follow. Welcome. Uh, you can steal from people though, right? Oh, maybe not.
I love how there always has to be an angry element to this game. Before it was your uncle that was gonna break your kneecaps in, and now it's the the volcano. Do I repair cars or boats? Yes. We go here, can I? Oh, you can't break into cars. Unfortunate. Okay, you guys wanted to see if we could sweep something into the ocean? Here, hold on. Go. 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 No. No. Oh! Mm, it looks like there might be an invisible wall here. Uh. Yeah. No, you, you can't. Ah! No, we're, we're okay. No, no, no. We're getting there. We're getting there. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. He's stuck on the light post. Can we not? I think this will instantly make the volcano very, very... Guys, like, not happy with me. <laughs> no, I think this is the limit. I don't think you can. I don't think you can sweep them further than that. Yeah, that just lives there now. That's okay. It's an amphibious car. Why does no one want to buy stuff from my store? I have nice things. I love how the driver just accepts his fate. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? He just gets out and stares. He's just like, this? Who, who do you think you are? He honestly actually just lives there, though, now. Angry God sounds more like, more realistic than Mafia Uncle gifting you gas station in the middle of nowhere. I feel both are very equally as likely. The game is stuttering a little bit. Okay. We'll probably need to buy some more fuel soon, too. Methinks. Buy my stuff. Buy my snack. Yeah. Uh, place it all, place it all. That's all we can fit. Oh, I wonder if it's just nighttime. I don't know. It's just, it feels a little yucky right now. I don't know if you guys are like noticing that or not. Well, he literally lives there now, and that is a Skyrim stair. Speaking of sweeping, Canada's in first place for women's curling. Oh, nice. Nice. Neat. I think he got out because you can't move it anymore. He's... <laughs> I mean, probably. Hi, Fenora. It's so good to see you again today. How are you? What have you been up to? I think that guy wants his truck back. What do you mean? He already has his truck. It's not like he's lost it. Why am I losing so many frames? Uh, Octopus, thanks for the follow. Welcome, how you doing? I feel like, wow. There's like a memory leak or something in the game. I just went from 60 frames to 18. What? Yeah, Venor, how are you? It's good to see you. The ball and chain is there for the workers that don't want to do overtime. <laughs> okay, let me get this car out of the wall. I feel like this car is maybe what's causing us to lag right now. Or like, I don't know, maybe I'm just... Sir. 
Out. 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 Okay, we're gonna have to reset everything. That's okay. Where's the reset button? It's over here, right? That's the oh no button. The oh my god, all the cars are... Firm. That's not how I wanted to reset the cars and the customers! Jesus! Oh no! Holy crap is right! Well, chat, we've cleared it! Oh my god. You know what, guys? I don't want to have to do this. But I'm probably going to have to um, reduce my settings here. Uh, my computer can run most games at like fairly high graphics. And I don't know why this game is... We're at 60 again. Oh, maybe we can just chill and wait. Uh, it, it, it literally goes from 60 to 30. It's unfortunate. Graphics. Let's just do preset. Oh my god, I hate that. Let's do preset high. And see if that makes things a little bit better. Maybe? Hold on. Fry engine. That escalated quickly? That was a get the hell out of here sort of thing, yeah. Uh, I think it's running a little bit better. Delivery, fuel, much as I can get. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Not a fan, though. Not a fan. I'm assuming we can eventually paint this, too, and make it nice. Let's start at boat fueling. Could be game needing more than 8 gigabytes of virtual RAM. Is that all I have? I don't think the game should be that, like, resource-heavy, though. It's not that complicated of a game. Oh! Oh. Okay, we can swim. It's like they knew that you would do that right there, too. Yeah, but dude, this isn't like a triple A game. I joined just as she was taking everyone out. <laughs> How you doing? If we ever see here Ultra saying she's going to reset chat, we should all run and fast. What feels more defeating? Lowering graphics settings or lowering difficulty settings? I never lower difficulty settings, so I don't know what that's like. So the only thing that I can relate to is lowering the graphics. No, I never, I never lower difficulty for games. If anything, I'm always like hardest difficulty person. Triple A or not, it changes nothing. It, it would, though. Like, this isn't, like, cyberpunk, right? I don't think it's well-optimized. I think that there... Personally, I think that there are, like, some pretty heavy memory leaks in here. Because, um... Where was I going with this? Like, it was even bouncing around and we were, like, going as low as... 20, 18 frames per second in areas that we previously had no problems with. Oops, no! Back in the ocean. Horde, it's so good to see you. It's going alright. It's going alright. How are you? Is this a noob thing? I'm too pro to understand. <laughs> Uh, 
had a similar problem with Baldur's Gate 3 after one update. Guys, check out Gord, good friend of the stream. Fantastic content creator, chill, easygoing vibe. Um, Gord was last playing Stardew Valley. We were playing that too earlier in the week. If you guys are looking for a streamer who uh, is just, just so chill and has such a soothing voice, definitely go and check him out. He is one of my favorite content creators on the platform. It was really good, Gord. I just, uh, I happened to play it on a day where I was, like, kind of exhausted, unfortunately. Okay, we need to serve one more customer, and then we can go to the next, um, next whatever. What is this? I don't even, I don't even know. Crap. That does not count, but okay. Yeah, it was good, Gord. It was good. I just wish I could have played it longer, but um, I streamed on a day where I had just finished my shift at the farm, so I was like pretty tired and bushed by the time I already even started stream, unfortunately. I wonder if it's like the busier your gas station is, the more the volcano gets mad. When you play started, do you just do whatever and chill or min max the heck out of crop profits? Uh, kind of both. I try to min max, but I'm also like, it's not the end of the world if, if we don't. That's fair, Gord, that's fair. Yeah, no, it's great. It's really cute. I love the, there's like random new items everywhere too that I, didn't recognize I was like I don't even know what this is what was it there's like a, a new type of weed new weeds and seaweeds or not seaweeds it was like sea s slime or I don't know what it was am I a bartender in this game no I have a convenience store Konbini. Buy my stuff, please. What do we not have any of? No. Oh, oh my god, put it back. Put the glasses on. Hi, inactive. How are you? Nihongo Josu? that? This game has changed a lot. This is a new DLC. This is the Tidal Wave DLC. And no one wants to come to my convenience store. Why? Maybe I need more parking. Dude, this guy looks scary. Is there such thing as do people do speedruns for this game? Complimenting your Japanese for knowing Kombini. <laughs> What is it? Kombini wa zoko desu ka? Oh, flashing me. That's very inconvenient. Leaving a bar? I think you misheard. I don't know what I said. I don't think I said that though. Kombini wa zoko desu. The convenience store is there. Oh my god. I'm so bad at this minigame. Stop. Oh no! Nice. That's just Carl. He stars in a kid's show on public access. <laughs> People speedrun rock sims? I'm pretty sure someone has speedrun this. Yeah. Nice. Nice. I'll see you later, buddy. Buy a car fuel dispenser. We need to have gas station level two. Uh, can we do that? 
Plus a hundred dollars. What? <gasps> Ooh. Hi, Reese. How you doing? Pieces. The kind of bear belt for that register feels highly unnecessary. Is the volcano happy or unhappy with that? What does that mean? Who can read smoke signals? <laughs> oh my god. What do they want? Oh, fuel dispense. Oh, okay, I see. So we fuel both cars and boats. Oh my god. Okay, and now that we have... Oh my god, can I hire someone yet, please? Oh. Now that we have... Um, gas station level 2, that means we can sell alcohol, cigarettes, and ice cream. It's just, it's all I've ever wanted to sell. I think I can actually... Oh my god, I can actually buy all of those. In speed runs of OS <laughs> OS installations. <laughs> this is so weird. Let me spar the other fuel. Anyone remember the monkey after Jimmy Neutron? Hi, I'm Paul. Yeah, I do. I think the volcano's okay. okay. Like, I don't think it's actually that upset. Oh, this is not snapped to the wall anymore, eh? Oh, yeah, da 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 da. Press F to pick up. R. There we go. Working while you work. Reese's, thank you for the lurk. I really do appreciate you. Thanks for hanging out with us tonight. Thank you, thank you. You've got mail. Oh my god. Apparently, do I have a washroom now? I swear it said I had a washroom, but I don't see it. I don't think we do. A smear at the boat feeling. Did that police car say California Highway Patrol? I don't know. We can pay attention next time, though. Fuel delivery at the warehouse gate. What? So much stuff that just needs to be thrown out. But Venora, what have you been up to today? Encoder, good evening. How you doing? Oh my god, why am I so itchy here? Oh. Oh my god, there's like a the Pippa fuzz thing or something. Oh my god. Having the cat is like the worst thing in the world. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to be right back. I can't do I can't I can't do this right now. <laughs> be right back. Hello. What is going on on my phone? Um it was like the tiniest, tiniest little like I think it was like a fiber from one of my covers or something. I don't know I don't know how else to explain it, but it was just like crash is full. I got you, homie. Imagine that, but with two fluffy cats, the fur gets everywhere. Yeah, I believe that.
island is Hawaii. Yeah, I would assume so. Bleaker, hey, how you doing? Good to see you. Um, let's go buy some products for the shelves that we just got to. Serene! Oh my goodness! Hi, how you doing? Good to see you. Yeah, too. Uh, okay. Have you played this game before? I feel like you have. I get the I get the feeling that you have played like this series before. Uh, yeah. Let's put it behind me. Sure. Can I move the the trash can. Uh, no, not. That's okay. No, this can go. <laughs> oh, God. Go. Here. I haven't played this, but it looks fun. Oh, it's really great. You might actually really like it. So I'm playing the new DLC, which is like kind of <laughs> located in like uh, Hawaii, like a beach town. But the main game is like, I don't know. I don't know. Where where was the main game base, guys? Like Arizona or like somewhere deserty. But you run a gas station. You improve it. You level it up. You deal with weird random shenanigans. We've already, there's a volcano in this game that we have to try not to piss off. Otherwise it kills everybody on the island. Um, and then it turns out we have the ability to evoke tsunamis. Yeah, Serene, if you like Supermarket Simulator, you'll actually like this a lot better. It's a, it's a little bit more um, optimized, and there's a, a bit more automation involved in the game, too. Which is where I felt like I started getting... Um, I felt really tired of... Uh, how do I rotate this again? I was starting to feel really tired... I can't talk and do this at the same time. Oh my god. Um, that's why I started getting really tired of uh, Supermarket Simulator because I was just like, I am having to do everything all by myself and like, this is a lot now. This is just me in the back room ordering things. Like that's, that's where I'm at at the game is all I do is I'm just in the back on the computer ordering and I do nothing else in that game. Guys, check out stream, fantastic content creator. We love uh, supporting female content creators here. She's very, very sweet. Very awesome. Um, plays like simulation games too. Plays awesome games. Played a game that was like overcooked, but with making cars, it was wild. Yeah, stream. I highly recommend you check out this game. Um, is 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 great. I think they're offering it on Keymailer right now. I don't know if you use Keymailer or not. Um, what am I doing? Customer customers everywhere. But I think from what I saw, if you request it on Keymailer, uh, if you give them an email as well, they'll also give you the base game too, which is nice if they select you. Yeah, hey guys, if you guys, I know a lot of you like Supermarket Sim. If you guys want to check out another streamer who is also playing that, definitely go and check out Stream. He's great. Okay, let's order some stuff. We need ice cream. <laughs> what do we need? Ice cream, cigarettes, <laughs> and alcohol. <laughs> and oh, there's a scuba diving thing. That and then that and can I do that? Is that too much? No, we can order that. Cool. Neat. Sorry, what level is your, uh, oh my god. What level is your store in Supermarket Sim? I don't even know what that is. Uh, I kind of feel like there should be a whole thing where you lug the trash up and drop it into the volcano. Uh, that sounds hilarious. There's a mod in Supermarket Sim that allows you to order more than 10 things at a time. 
I don't think that's the issue, though. It's not ordering 10 things at a time. It's like having to go out and drag it into your warehouse, and then it's just like this back and forth, right? At least for me, like, that's that's my gripe with it. It's not, it's not, it's, the issue isn't, like, not being able to order enough. It's just like, oh, wow, like, I'm just, I'm running back and forth the whole time. They're only level 13. Don't have the store. Oh my god, that's brutal, Srain. That's brutal. Get the storage room. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, no. How do I say your name? No lawn. No lawn air. Welcome. Sorry, I only speak English. I'm not a very cultured person. I can't even. I can barely even speak French, and I'm Canadian. I'm supposed to be able to speak French, but I can't. South American beer brand that's been inserting their logo into Star Wars and Indiana Jones movies? Oh, no way. I believe the next supermarket sim update will have people who stock the storage room from the streets. Oh, thank God, dude. But even then, like, I think they, they still need to, like... Actually, no, that would be great because I would just buy, like, everything all out in the street and... <laughs> Sorry, do you have any big plans for this week, by the way? Are you doing anything super fun? If you are, please let us know. Uh, Noelle said, how to have a beautiful morning. Oh, that's really nice. That's nice of them. That's nice that it was something nice to do. <laughs> I don't know. We've had some people come. I'm usually it's a nice thing, but we've had some people come in here with some not so nice things being said in different languages. Das is Nick. So, shot. Are you, am I saying bad things? What are you making me say? <laughs> Is it clear I use Google Translate? <laughs> okay, place all, place all. Yeah, we got stuff on the shelf. We got, we got ice cream. We got this. Yep, great. Hi, DC Mitch, how are you? It's good to see you, welcome. How you doing? How's your week been? We need to add more storage room in the supermarket sim. Oh, 100%, yeah. No, I agree. I agree. Uh, probably need more fuel. I'll order. I have no money. Hope to working in the garden. <gasps> oh, that's lovely. What are you What are you growing in your garden? After playing Supermarket Simulator, this is the next game, Gas Station Sim. I mean, technically, this game came first. <laughs> technically. That's not so nice, Ultra. Fair. Seen a few messages in Russian and German come through in another streamer I mod for, and it's rarely anything nice that comes through. <laughs> Solar panels are now working. Oh, neat. Did you just install those recently, or have you always had those? The supermarket looks different. It's a little different. Just, just a touch, though. Oh my god. Uh, I would say this game has been out for three years. Close to three years. Can someone, can someone check that? Fuel status is low. I know, I know. Where's the fuel boat? Is it here? Oh my god, it's not even here yet. Get over here! This is such a dodgy looking building. <laughs> recently installed like a month ago? Nice, dude. I was looking at my, uh, my power bill recently and I'm like, man, I live in a part of the world where 
power is not that expensive, but I, I'm just like, it would be so much nicer if I, like, we had some solar power or something here. Be nice. Ooh, this eventually drops and lets you go that way. Oh, <gasps> neat. Nothing yet. In about a month, I'll have various peppers, tomatoes, squash, beans, peas, carrots, corn, cucumber, just to name a few. Okay. John, can I come over to your place? Can I? <laughs> can I come over and hang out in, in your in your garden? That sounds really nice. September 2021. So yeah, I'm about right. I said I said three years, right? Okay. We absolutely what we we have windmills where I live, but hilariously we get none of the benefit from it since the power is sent downstate. Oh weird. I, I'm so bad at this minigame. You're supposed to do all of them without stopping the conveyor belt. Like I can never do it. Stop natural gas to go to green energy. Oh no way! Uh, TM Gawa. How do I say your name? TM Gando. <laughs> Welcome. Do you know how to handle goats and chickens? Uh, John, I actually work on a farm. Fun fact: I actually do know how to handle goats and chickens. Yeah, when I'm not streaming, I, I work on a farm. Fun fact about me. Just, uh, don't get me- I just don't want to handle any chickens that are, um... Oh, what's the word? Oh... I don't remember the word. Actually, you know what? Let's not talk about it on stream, because it's not a nice topic. Sometimes chickens have some pretty bad, nasty problems. Uh, I think it's prolapsed. That's the word I'm looking for. I don't want to deal with any prolapsed chickens. Hi, Spirit, how you doing? I know, dude. <laughs> None of my parents' basement anymore. <laughs> God, they were so nice and so helpful to be able to do that for me, though. It was really nice of them. Brooding? Prolapsed. Don't, don't Google it if you are squeamish. Don't, don't Google that if you're a squeamish person. Very yucky. Mine are well taken care of. What type of chickens do you have? I mean, you can have a well taken care of chicken. It doesn't stop it from prolapsing, though. I don't know. Chickens are just like, they're either really hardy or they're not. There's like, <laughs> there's kind of no in between. They're like, yeah, we're good. Or yeah, no, actually, our vent is too small and uh, poop gets stuck on it. So uh, en enjoy. <laughs> what is this? Ice cream and drink and chippy chip, chippy chippy. Do you have to correct that? Uh, a chicken that's prolapsing or its vent is too small. New terms for cows too, that's not good when looked up. Yeah, I believe that, yeah. A lot of things can prolapse, yes. <laughs> it's, it's different, a lot of different body parts can do that. Just particularly stinky with chicken. How angry will the volcano be if your fuel delivery tanker beaches itself and spills its cargo? The volcano will probably destroy the whole island if that happens. Um, okay, so we're probably gonna have to refuel fuel again. 
What does it want me to do? Boats refueled, cars refueled, customer serve. Scuba equipment rental. And then toilet. We don't have a toilet. We need to buy that. Yeah, do that. It's probably an upgrade, hey? Yeah, it is. 100 bucks for the toilet? That's a steal. I had to kindly ask her to stop sending me pics because I... Why would she send you pics of that stuff? <laughs> White leghorn fog? Oh, nice. They are dual purpose. Like, are you talking about like eggs and meat? Okay, we've got the washroom. Now we want scuba diving, which is 250 bucks. Uh, we'll be able to get that. Hi, sir. We'll be able to get that pretty soon. Volcanoes like a clean restroom, Ultra. Get <laughs> to Nigel. <laughs> That's it. That's it. Wait for the Get out of your car. Let me fill it up. person so if someone has Montezuma's revenge in the bathrooms what you're saying is that's a bad thing right where is the what where oh it's here uh flush the toilet when you only fail when you stop trying why is that put on the washroom don't hurry, don't worry, do your best, and flush the rest. <laughs> oh my god, what a weird game. The sink is the real number one, wash your hands. Oh my god, it's just a- oh my god, does it go just into the ocean? Stop. This is the worst washroom in the- where's the sink? Oh, is that the sink? Wait, please? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold up. Is this just... Okay, we don't know where the poop goes, but it doesn't reach the ocean. I'm gonna tell you that much. It does not reach that far. We're doing our best, chat. She has the stomach for it, so she didn't think anything of it? I have the stomach for a lot of things too, Star Fox, but I I don't send dunk pictures. <laughs> oh no, Dinosaur Dave, I'm so sorry. You put a period in between I'm and now, and it thinks that you posted a link. Um, I'm so sorry, you 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 didn't say anything wrong. It, you just got modded because it thought you said a link. Uh, I can still see your message though, hold on. Diary Awareness Week starts Monday and runs till Friday. <laughs> Jeez. It's been a hot minute. I'm now 6,000 kilometers in my road trip and have crossed three seats so far. Today, I'm on an epic fossil-filled cave. Oh, that's amazing. What type of fossils? I'm doing all right, Dinosaur Dave. How are you? Whoa, super. Yeah, that was the message. I have an ad that has a house on Martha's Vineyard and they have saying out there if it's yellow let it mellow if it's brown flush it down yes that is that is a thing <laughs> that is most certainly a thing so many little fishies little fishy fishy good boys go in the ocean be free every time i come back here it's just like there's just more and more little fish everywhere Uh, we should be able to afford, um, should be able to afford the scuba thing now, by the way. Is that it? It's looking cleaner, guys. It's looking cleaner. Ultra, what has frames and glass? I... You, when I shove my glasses up your... Yep. Lefty, how you doing?
Australian megafauna. Ooh, nice. Super fun. Sorry, what? <laughs> Glasses prolapse. <laughs> Customer at fuel. Oh my god, there's just so many customers like all day. Does this on glasses streamer? I'm not doing I as much as I would love to take the glasses off the spite lefty, y'all have too many points and it's gonna turn into a back and forth that I don't want to deal with, okay? We bought the scuba place. Wow. Lefty is an Australian fauna, definitely not mega. Lefty would never. <laughs> Scuba and surfing! Order scuba or surfing equipment using the PC and add them to the sufficient box shelf with limited space to be available for customers. Interact with the chalkboard to check the active equipment and set its exchange threshold at which it will be automatically replaced with a new one. This sounds complicated. Customers pay for every second of equipment rental, but with every second its quality also deteriorates. The more damage the equipment, the greater risk of customer's death. <laughs> oh. What happens if- I, you know what? I have a feeling if people die, the volcano also doesn't like that, too. <laughs> volcano doesn't like littering. The volcano doesn't like death. Apparently killing people is bad. Allegedly. Oh no, fishy! Go outside. Tara, it's good to see you. You do not have 150k channel points in here, Lefty. That is a big fat lie, dude. The biggest lie I've ever seen in my life, dude. Okay, delivery, products, scuba diving. Uh, we only have the glasses. I would never do that, by the way. Yeah, okay, Tara. But those glasses, holy cow, you're a heckin' nerd. You know what makes me super uncomfortable? There are some people who come in. It's, you know what? It's one thing to say. Ultra, you look really nice with glasses. Th thank you. Appreciate that. That's, that's, that's appropriate. But the people who come in to go, wow, wait, you look really hot with glasses on. I'm just like, and the glasses are coming off because this is making me uncomfortable. <laughs> I don't like this. Nim, how you doing? It's good to see a friend. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Uh, more, more or less, like, yikes. Big yikes. Big uh-oh. Who called you a nerd just now? You did. I should turn on my AC. Yes, that is, that is the solution to that. Fish. Garbage? No. Ultra, you look ri- Can someone screen cap that and send that to Dunk, please? Um, and make sure- can you edit the Keck W out of his message, too? Yeah, when 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 you guys have done that, just let me know, okay? Thanks. If I get left right good nighted at TwitchCon by dunk, I'm blaming <laughs> left right good nighted. <laughs> Jeez. I have to do it this slow, otherwise I can't get the bonus. Oh my god, I'm not even gonna get the bonus. No, I got it! DM'd to me. Hold on, just let me, let me, let me quickly do this mini game here. Let me get this police officer his chips. Did you actually know you did? Why does the resolution look so bad on it? 
Yeah, okay. Oh, it's still doing... Okay, hold on. Why is it going back to this screen? That's my, uh, sorry, I just blinded everybody in chat, my bad. Properties... Display 2. There we go. Yeah, that's not a good look, dude. That's not a good look. Better than saying you look horrible in glasses, right? Um... You know what? I don't- I think both are not good. Both are not good. This is so inaccurate. <laughs> uh, if we didn't already get a shout out for Lofty, if we can get one, I would appreciate that, guys. Guys, check out Lofty. Uh, he's probably going to be playing some supermarket simulator sometime soon as well, too. Uh, fantastic content creator, really hilarious. Also does a lot of horror games, but end of the day, like, I hang out with him because he's just so freaking hilarious. Um, good friend of the stream. And if you get annoyed, like, oh my god. If you guys like annoying me, ticking me off, follow him. Go check him out. Anytime I anytime I go into his stream, I just get abused. Just abuse 24-7, dude. Justice for Lufty. Star Fox, get out. <laughs> get out. Yeah, we need to buy some more fuel. Delivery, fuel supply. Yeah. yeah. Lofty is being framed. I don't think so. Hey, where's my scuba shop? It's like, uh, oh my god, I actually don't know where it is. It's like, ah, it's over there. So much garbage out here. Oh, look at all the people who wanted. Okay, order scuba. Na 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 na. Okay. Threshold set. Let's set the threshold at like. Okay, there's a twenty percent chance of death at fifty. Thanks. Ah. Oh no. Let's do 45%. I think that's fine. Do they have the the lockers? The... How do I do this? Do I need to buy shelf for it? I don't actually know how this works. It says equip. Your lockers. Oh? Oh, here we go. At all. Okay. Here we go. Okay, apparently they're using them, so. Less than 50%. <laughs> We got a boat over here. All AI knows that Lufty, what Lufty is, and it made a justice for Lufty image. Oh, Luffy! Wait, what's Luffy? I don't know what that is. We gotta clean our shop up. Ugh. Oh, it's an anime thing. Oh. Right. Oh, three. So funny. Before uh, Dunk went to sleep, I was like, hey, when you get up, can you make some chung fan? <laughs> He's like, sure. <laughs> Okay. 
Okay, he's gonna go away. Fuel status is low. Yeah, we gotta we gotta take this fuel delivery. Purchase a toilet and the new scuba diving stand to start renting. Oh, I've already done that. Nah. Um. Okay. Garbage. Apparently the volcano is mad. Again. Fluffy FV? How do people miss the T in your name all the time? What? Your dunk's the way. Um, let's see if we can stock our store a little bit more. Products, uh, go free. Yep. Two. Then we have, God. This is so expensive. Can I buy all of that? Jesus, Lefty. How much do I owe you? I think we're actually doing pretty well. I can't wait for we haven't gotten any like party buses yet, and I don't I don't know what that looks like in this game. Okay, um, Dunk is not awake, so I need to go and make sure that he is awake. I will be right back. And we have a hype train. What did you what did you do? Beefy's Fusion coming at the tier one sub, my dude. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. And Lofty, I swear to God. This is why mom doesn't love you, okay? Hi Trace, how are you? Good to see you. I didn't even notice. <laughs> Yay! What are we doing? Let's rip fuel. Thanks, guys. Have a nice day. You give me the ability to stir you up, I will. No, no, no. No, no, I'm good, thanks. I'm good, thanks. I'm good, thanks. I, I know. I'm good, thanks, though. Did you get the money from your long-lost cousin? Twice removed? Oh no, it was a, uh, it was, it was a prince, actually. From Europe somewhere, Trees. <laughs> Trees, how's the rest of your stream, by the way? Trees was playing, uh, Lethal Company earlier today. Um, she also has done, like, collapse with mana. Also, yeah, guys, mana streams too, do you guys know that? Where's Kaylin? Kaylin, <laughs> it's your one job. Great, great, great uncle Prince Eugene is an exam tomorrow. Ah, there you go. <laughs> oh my lord, Galen, I appreciate you. We can get a shout out for Trace. I would appreciate the judge too. Trace, thanks for hopping in and saying hi. As appreciates you. Hope you're doing well. Hope your stream went well. I wish I could clean this and make it nicer. It's just so yucky in here. What does this say? Use both hands, climb slowly away, always face ladder. Maintain three points of contact while ascending or descending the ladder. Do not stand on top of the ladder. Oh my god. Oh, you- oh, sorry. You swapped from Lethal Company to Spearfarer. That's nice. 
Mon the monster is so lovely. You guys are awesome. Thank you guys so much for the shout outs. <laughs> Y'all are amazing. Uh, no, it's all good, Trace. All good. Yeah, and Mana was doing Snowrunner earlier, and uh, how many times did you flip Mana? Like 10 times? At least? That is a small car. Does Twitch allow mods to use shoutouts on themselves? Yes. Uh, it would, actually. Task complete. Nice. Oh my goodness, we still have to do so much more stuff. Purchase the surfing stand, shower, and workshop to increase your earnings. Uh, we're probably gonna have to buy more fuel again. Hello. Giving me a shout out. Tara, nice are you gonna continue to do uh, Stardew Valley content, by the way? <laughs> Products. Okay, yeah, we need more of this stuff. Need more of this stuff. Can I even afford all of that? Efficient warehouse capacity. Oh. Upgrades, warehouse, how much is this? 250 bucks. Do it. Oh, it's bigger now. Neat. That is good to see you. You want to? Gonna do that more thunder? Nice, dude. Nice. This game has changed so much. Well, Trees, to be fair, this is a DLC that's based in, like, Hawaii, so, I mean, visually it's going to look very different. But yeah, no, they have actually added, like, a bunch of different mechanics to it. Um, like, even in the base game, they have, uh, like, a workshop, they have, like, the car wash, um, they have an airport, all sorts of cool things. And they've kind of, like, implemented all of those perks into this game, too, like the newer one now. Which is neat. I thought this was vanilla DLC. What? What? <laughs> no one's died from scuba diving yet. I'm gonna take that as a win. That is a win. Okay, we're gonna check our mail because the computer really wants us to. Welcome! Neener, neener. Aren't these... Aren't these just the messages that... Believers are now arriving on water. Shark! A dangerous shark has been prowling the area for years. The moment the shark is spotted by the Coast Guard, siren will sound on the island. If you do not intervene, the shark will attack a few people in the water to satiate itself, which can make the Chunchu Manchu very angry. The only way to scare it away is to use the cannon? <laughs> what? The shark must be hit in the fin protruding above the water surface or in its upper part closest to the surface. The shark health bar is- Where is this cannon? It's so wild. Soon will be a, a gas naval base. <laughs> sure. USS Iowa reporting for shark duty. Where is this cannon though? Is it on here? Oh, this looks a lot more put together. Oh, that's really nice. Okay, so as we upgrade this, it actually looks a little bit nicer. That's, uh, that's good to know. And then, can we cross here yet? No, we can't. There's so much garbage here. I don't know what cannon it's talking about. I have not seen a single cannon in this game yet, so... 
Do you guys see a cannon? Because I don't. I don't know. Fewer dead smelly fish around. Correct. Correct. Oh, that's actually really nice that when we upgrade this, it, like, becomes less scummy. <laughs> The cannon, not cannon? Dude, I don't know. This this guy looks like he's gonna pay me in dollar dues. Lefty, what do you think? Is he still here? <laughs> yeah. Uh, got new mail, customer at the boat fueling. Neener, neener, neener. I'll have to take a look at it after stream. Hey, Wolf, that sounds really funny. Yeah, I don't know what the cannon is. I don't think I even own it right now. Maybe that's something I need to, like, purchase and, like, upgrade? For chance. Yeah, what do you guys think of this update? What do you guys think? Uh, well, it's not, sorry, not an update. What do you guys think of this DLC? I'm really enjoying it. I'm, I'm like, kind of, I'm very pleasantly surprised by it. Oh, stinky. That fills up so fast. DLC. I mean, yeah, I know, but like all DLC are updates, but not all updates are DLC, right? That's why I corrected myself. Mm. Okay. So delivery products. We definitely need more of this stuff. I have enough. For that we have enough money snack and let's get some more fuel while we're it, you basically have to like not enough money <laughs> great are you able to throw trash into the volcano? No, the volcano's too far away. It's like way up on the I don't think so. I can try, maybe, but I think it's it's just too far. Like here. There's no way. Yeah, no, dude. <laughs> okay, delivery truck is going to be here soon. I'm wondering if when we upgrade the warehouse, if it also automatically upgrades our fuel capacity, it might. Okay, that's almost here. Hello! Do not smoke in this area. I bet you there's something super fun and secret down here. And or maybe just the shark, I don't know. See you later. I really do. I've always enjoyed this game. 
Um, I have a lot of fun with it. I don't think I've ever been not impressed by their... I think the only gripe that I have with this is it just... It doesn't seem super optimized, but... That's something that could be easily fixed. Right? Two hundred fifty-five pumps and a store the size of a Rhode Island. Oh my God! Is that actually how big it is? Okay, can I do the fuel now? Cost how much? <gasps> so much money. But yeah, no, it looks like we do have a uh, higher capacity now, which is nice. And then if we were to upgrade things, what do we got? We're looking at. Oh my god, $200 to upgrade it. I would rather have full fuel first before we upgrade things. I don't know if I sound silly for saying that, but... Oh my god, I thought that, that was in-game. I was like, what on earth is that? There is- I don't think there's- is there really any need to have a gas station that big, though? Like, that just sounds ridiculous. That's ridiculous. Like, that's just, like, that is like the most American thing I could possibly think up of. I will actually change where my camera is because you guys can't actually see the goals, I don't think. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, where is a good place for me to hide? If I go... This is really not a good place. I guess if we chill up here? How's that chat? Oh my god, why am I not at the top? Hold on. I think that's good. Or maybe you guys you guys can live down here. There. Dead center of screen? No. I haven't seen the kid yet. I don't think we have the kid. Why does it look so spooky outside? No, it's not. No, it's not going there. We need a redeem for it? I don't think you do. One million channel points. Some of you guys are not too far off from that, though. So that's a bit of a problem. DG has the redeem for him to give you money. That's ridiculous. But also very on brand for him. I can't remember how much Dunk has. Sing Dunk has a lot. Berries and cream song. Go for it. Berries and cream, berries and cream. I'm a little lad who loves berries and cream. What's that from? Awesome. Dunk says he has like over 
750,000 points. Oh, no! Well, shoot. He's not going to get that. He's going to be very mad about that. You're amazing. Oh, no, he's fine with that, actually. That was okay. No, it's all good, Venora. Thanks so much for hanging out. I appreciate you. Guys, if we can get a shout-out for Venora, um, I would really appreciate that, guys. Fantastic content creator. Also plays a variety of games uh, that we also play here, too. He's really sweet. Very nice. Very outgoing. Um, we have a lot of mutual friends. Playing like Helldivers, too. Oh, my goodness. Hey, guys, go check her out. Nora, thank you so much for hanging out with us. I appreciate you. You don't like that slide? Uh, what am I doing here? We're doing... No, 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 upgrades. Gas station level three. Let's go. Is it happier? Is that happy? Oh, you managed to calm the volcano. Oh my god, so when we upgrade our thing, it's happier. Wild. Does this just stay here in the middle? Can I not edit where this goes? Looking pretty okay, guys. We're looking pretty okay. Uh, customer at the fuel. Dante, thank you for the lurk. I appreciate you, friend. Enjoy your lurk. Hope you're having a cozy, nice uh, day or evening wherever you are in the world. I am having a fantastic stream. Thank you for asking. Have you ever seen the pineapple on pizza game? Yeah, it's weird. <laughs> it, has, it has nothing to do with pineapple on pizza, dude. What else can we upgrade? We can get showers. Hell yeah. That just sounds nasty. <gasps> oh my god, did you read that sign? Stop. Did you see that sign? Shower. One dollar to watch. Two dollars with me, ten dollars. <laughs> Ew, why? <laughs> it's not okay. Hey, Derek, how you doing? Bro, where's your badge? Show off your badge to everyone. What are you doing? You hiding it? Guys, uh, check out Derek. Um, uh, what the tanner? Did you know the fastest way to learn about Canadian milk is open a PDF about it? Not looking at anyone in particular here. That would that that would be mana, yes. You have to click on it in every chance. Yeah, I think eventually, like it auto whatevers. Uh, guys. If you guys want to join me in giving Derek a big congratulations, Derek, a.k.a. a fat man in a chair, he just got partnered today. Congratulations, Derek. Very well deserved. I'm sure you are so, in like, just utterly relieved and ecstatic. And yeah, dude. Thanks for hopping by. I think we got a shout out. Yeah, we did get a shout out for him, too. Yeah, he got it. I know. Isn't that fantastic? I think that's great. Really happy for him. Get some more scuba. Oh my god, it's expensive. In stock, zero. Can I buy all of that? Do I have enough money for that? I do. <sighs> yeah. What are you gonna, um... Have your celebration stream? Soon?
Thank you, Bank. To make tomorrow, but birthday is Saturday. Oh, no way. Oh, my God. So our birthday and partner celebration. Well, isn't that just lovely and fantastic? What a nice birthday present. Oh, that's really nice. <laughs> oh, my goodness, dude. money do I have? $192. Showers used by customers. One. Dude, I would not want to shower there. <laughs> yeah, if we don't, uh, if I don't see you, Derek, happy birthday in advance. After a few denials, uh, I mean, that's pretty typical. I know some people who, um, I don't know how they managed to do it, but they got partnered first try, which is kind of unheard of. I don't know, maybe, maybe whoever was doing the applications those three months just was super happy to partner people. But no, like, I know people who have, like, they've been, it, they took, like, 13 tries, dude, before they got it, so it's, uh... Yeah, it is, it is what it is. You cry. I know, right? It's like, it's literally tears of relief. <laughs> it's like, oh my god. At least for me, that's what it was. I was just like, holy guacamole. I don't have to grind for this anymore. It's really nice. No equipment at scuba rental. I know, I'm getting there. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Okay. It's- oh no, absolutely, Derek. No, like, big time. It's nice. I'm really happy for you. No, seriously, dude. I- I had no doubts that you would get partnered. Um. Absolutely no doubts at all. I was not stressed for you. I what? I was not fussing for you, because I'm like, he's gonna get it. It's fine. Okay. Do they pay for that? They must have to pay for that. <sighs> okay, what else do we need? We need um, surfing equipment. Let's see if we can get that next. I know someone who got partnered first try. Took two months to get it. Oh my god, dude. Like, they- Their application, they were waiting for two months? That's brutal. That's- That sounds like something funky, actually. Um, god, I would hate that. <laughs> I think my first denial, I got it within, like, a few days. Okay, so we want to go to upgrades, and we want to get the surfing. Allows you to rent surfing equipment, yes, please. Wait, I'm assuming I need to buy. Is doing this comms the volcano? No equipment at the windsurfing rental. I can fix that. We can fix that. Surfing. Let's just buy as many as we can. Let's just do ten. Can we get ten? How much money do I have? $230, we cannot get 10. We can do that though. Yours was over a month, bro, that's brutal. The thing is, it's like, when they take such a long time to get back to you, you almost hope you're like, this is it, right? Like, this is them like, getting things together, probably, maybe, I don't know. Brutal, dude. Okay. Oh, crap. They get so upset when you do that, too. You're joking, right? You got it for free! Don't complain!
You're fussing. Can't you hire employees? I... So... Code's essentially, um... We just started this DLC. So we're only at, like, gas station level 3 right now. So as of right now, no. We can't hire employees. Bee sneeze! It's good to see you. Welcome. Yeah. Dude, I see you everywhere now, man. Didn't I see you this morning? <laughs> Can't remember if it was this morning or yesterday. I was just like, oh my god. Everywhere. Awesome. That was great. I don't know how we didn't know each other either. Because, like, with a name, like, firstly, you... Y your name orange, right? It's bright. Secondly, I love bees. I think I think they're the bees knees. But um yeah, dude. We get a shout out for bees. I would appreciate that, guys. Bees. Thank you for hopping in here and saying hi. Super. Oh, you're playing Lightyear Frontier. How was that? It's like farming but with mechs, right? Uh, I was planning on playing that, and then I lost all of my internet. And then by the time I could get to it, I was kind of over it. <laughs> that, sorry, that's not the right way to phrase things. It was more or less like, um... I just was prioritizing other games uh, by the time I had my internet back, so... It's amazing! Oh, no way. Do you think you'll be streaming it again? <laughs> Yeah, no, dude. I'm just, I'm, I'm just happy to have you here. But I'm also happy to throw you a shout out, my dude. It's not a problem at all. Where is the cannon? This mysterious cannon that are, you're supposed to use to shoot the shark. I just, I don't know where that is. Eep. I also don't know where this. Uh, oh, is it over here? What is this? Such a great job. For your customers, we're safe for one day. Death count two. Oh, oh, okay. No, people are actually dying. Oh. <laughs> Definitely going to play it again. I think you might like it. To be honest, it's always super cozy here, and I think it fits your vibes. Okay, I, I think I have a key for it, so maybe I'll, uh, I'll, I'll take a look at it again. I'm assuming with surfboards, it's the exact same thing as the other thing where it's like you set a durability threshold yeah so we can set it at 22 percent chance of death correct yeah, that's probably fine go surfing have fun make good choices they knew what they did ultra they had it coming uh, it's because I, I set the- so you basically get scuba equipment or, like, windsurfing stuff, and you set the durability for what's acceptable, but once an item reach, reaches a lower durability, the chances of your customers dying increases. So I have my durability set to 45%, so as long as it's 45% or higher durability, they can keep using the equipment. But they have also, once it reaches, like, 44 what is it? Once it reaches 45% durability, they have a 22% chance of dying. Which I don't think the volcano likes very much. I don't think the volcano is cool with that. When you're in the water, go gently. They also want us to get the workshop up and going, which I don't really, I don't really care for the workshop. I feel like it's just super expensive to have up and running. I like the concept of it, but like. Whoa, super. It's sleepy and just starts breathing like she's never breathed a day in her life. I know, right? Dude, dogs are so precious. Oh, 
Oh my god, dude! Oh my god, put a shirt on! Holy guacamole. Jeez. I do not want to serve you. Bees, have you played Gas Station Sim before? It's a great game, if you haven't. Oh my goodness, dude. Yes, it's so good. This is the newest DLC that they just released today, by the way. Okay. Curly! Here for my shout out so I can immediately leave, out, leave after hair flip. Yes, don't actually. You you know you know it's gonna happen now. You you can't come in here guns a blazing saying crap like that in my stream and ex <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> I, is, I, I gotta ask, is Bees in on the meme? Because Bees was laughing a hell of a lot in your stream when I said that. Bees was laughing a hell of a lot in your stream. <laughs> really, how are you? It is so good to see you. <laughs> oh, you know this meme? <laughs> Great. <laughs> That's great. I'm doing really well, guys. Seriously, check out Curly. He, she is one of uh, the most fantastic content creators I know on this platform. She just dyed her hair a super fun, cool color, and I'm not going to tell you guys what color it is because you guys have to follow her to check it out and find out. But I will say it's the funniest thing ever because her hair now on her stream gets chroma keyed. So she kind of has like beautiful, slightly spooky hair. Dude, I, I was lurking. I was lurking in your stream and I wasn't, I was busy doing things, so I wasn't going to say anything. But the moment I saw your hair getting chroma keyed, I was like, stop. <laughs> you, I mean, sometimes she streams later in the day too, Bing. Uh, but yeah, guys, Curly's been doing a lot of Elden Ring and Baldur's Gate 3. Uh, definitely go and check her out. She's fantastic. She's amazing. She's so sweet. She's so beautiful and so full of love and joy and positivity. Great. Good vibes. Good vibes to be had. Also, Curly, I don't think you're... I, Lala pointed it out and I was like, well, crap. <laughs> I also don't think uh, when you went on your rant uh, about people backseating you because you're a woman, I don't... I genuinely don't think you lost any followers for saying that. It's, I think you were very diplomatic. I'm, I'm sure you were holding back some w choice words that you would have loved to have used instead of what you said on stream. Um, but no, I think I think it's it's good to say stuff like that, and it's totally totally true. It's like being a woman, being a female presenting on Twitch. It's like people are people backseat all the time like everywhere but they're more inclined to do it when you are a woman because so oh, oh she doesn't know how to play video games i gotta tell her i gotta tell her and then there's all sorts of excuses from oh my god just just oh i wasn't backseating i was just providing hints wow you're really mean to people who are just trying to help you out oh i wasn't serious i was just joking the funny thing is I We've had two people within the past two months do that to me, where when I'm playing SnowRunner, and this is my game, by the way. SnowRunner is my game. I have over 800 hours in it. I play on hard mode. I I would like to call myself an expert at that game, okay? I think I am. I think I can, I can like, say that, and I'm not wildly inaccurate. And these people try to tell me how to play the game, and I basically tell, I explain to them. I explain to them why they're wrong. I explain why they're wrong. And and they still double down. And then I show them, here, I'm gonna show you how wrong you are. I'm gonna show you why this doesn't work. And it's only then when I kind of, to be quite honest, embarrass them on stream. That's when, that's when the, when the, oh, I was just joking. I was just being sarcastic. Didn't you, <laughs> you believe me? And it's like, dude, you were yelling at me to do this for like, 30 minutes straight. What do you mean you're joking? No, that's very curly. I think that was great that you stood up and you you 
gave people the riot act. Greener Pastures! Dude, this game's great. It's awesome. It's good to see Greener Pastures. Amount of backseaters with games, especially like Elden Ring with female streamers, disgusts you. It's just, it's bad everywhere. It's particularly, I would say, it's as, as a woman who plays simulation games, it's particularly bad for women in simulation games because there's not a lot of us out there. And so people are just like, oh my god, she doesn't know how to fly an F-18 in DCS. I must tell her. <laughs> Wee. Really one of the reasons. Oh, no way, bees. No ways. Schrodinger's douchebags. Ooh, I like that. Talking with Quiddy and he told me he gets backseated on Souls games. Oh my god, stop. Okay, we have a shark. The moment the shark is spotted, the coast guard, the siren will sound. If you don't intervene, the shark will attack a few people in the water to satiate itself. The only way to scare it is using the cannon. Purchase one. Really? Yes, thank you. can't purchase the cannon because I'm I'm checking someone out at the register great okay cannon upgrades is it upgrades I don't know where the cannon is tools oh now we can steal with the pick lock nice pneumatic hammer wait what is that used for cannon hey, where's the shark you guys see it Press left mouse button to start firing. I don't see a shark. I think it's a big fat lie. I don't think there's any shark out here. You gonna... <laughs> Did it already eat people and leave? Is that what happened? I don't know. I think that's exactly what happened. Oh my... Oh dear. Uh oh. Whoops. Ooh, it's got a little sharky keychain on it. It's nice. Well, I try to deal with backseaters in a in a respectful way, and I try to temper myself because I have to deal with so much backseating that it gets to the point where I get a little heated is not the right word, but for someone who's not familiar with the stream, they come in, they go, oh my god, wow, she's so mean, right? Versus you guys were like, oh, another backseater, right? And so I need to really make sure that I my response is, is I dial it back a little bit because backseating is, is never justified. But if you're new to the channel and you just see me popping off, it just it just doesn't look very good or friendly. Or cozy vibes. <laughs> so I try my best to be respectful and be like, thanks, but no, you're wrong. Or I think one time I tried to phrase it. I was like, you know what? Would you like it if someone was saying this to you while you were playing the game? And they're like, I look up. I look up tutorials on YouTube. And I'm like, you, okay, you were. This is California Highway Patrol. Wild. And I'm like, you were the wrong person to use this as an example on. Great. <laughs> Out here firing a cannon like a champ. But yeah, but the shark already... I think the shark ate someone. I think the volcano's pretty ticked off about it, too. Good for you, but that's not for me. It's just... It's, the, it's so wild that if you shoot that cannon down, you can almost fly. That... Oh! Neat. I think, you know, Kodo, I think my channel rules are pretty clear, too. No, they are. You'd say ban them. Here's the thing, though, like, I don't think backseaters are inherently bad. I think, I think people get really excited. I think people just want to be helpful for the most part. And I, I think that's why it's important that we have these moments, these discussions, so that they can maybe check themselves and basically be like, oh, actually, like, yeah, this is like, 
super inappropriate and like I've been doing this for a while and like maybe I should stop, right? Like we're all about education, we're all about building these teachable moments on stream. And if someone's being very rude and very belligerent, then yeah, no, we ban them. But but I think it's important that we try to have these discussions instead of just blatantly banning people so that A, they don't backseat in my stream anymore, but they're less likely to go to Curly's stream and also backseat, right? Shooting the cannon at people is also funny. Oh my god. <laughs> have you just been like murdering people in this game? I had someone mad because my mod deleted a first time comment. It was backseating and they sent some pissed off comment. Yeah, I. Great. Spending my 20k points so that my joke Tanner ban isn't mod abuse. Oh, the timeout. See you later, Tanner. Sometimes I slip up and throw out a suggestion about the game, but I try to be mindful and rein myself in. Yeah, no, exactly. That's that's why I'm saying like it's just it's not inherently bad i think i think the biggest distinguishing factor is how is how someone responds to being told hey please don't backseat right you know you're gonna you're gonna find out real quick if they're a good community member or not or if they're like salvageable right pvp in a world no literally though um guys i'm gonna go grab some food real quick or I, I just got to step away from the computer for just a second. Uh, so hold on to your butts. And we're back. Bees, what did you watch? Curly, uh, you're getting some... I can never say it right. People in chat get so mad when I say it. But uh, tortilla. It's like meat, meat, meat pie. Curly, what are you streaming on uh, Saturday, by the way? No. <laughs> Please, I'm glad you liked it. Call me Zeej. Thanks for the follow. Appreciate you hanging out with us. And Nam, you're a sweetheart. Oh, those are really nice, kind words, my dude. Thanks for thanks for saying that. It's tortilla. It's like a Quebec thing. Meat pie. And okay, we need scuba stuff. What else do we need? We have a lot of stuff that we like need and just don't have. Shh, snack. Chunky O's. It's <laughs> great. Full trash, no equipment, mail. Neener, neener, neener. The volcano is slowly, progressively getting more pissed. I think I'm just gonna let him get mad that does sound that does sound Quebecois at all what, doesn't or does what do you are you insulting me or not Have a nice day. you get any weirdo customers at night in this game um I think the oddest guy we got was like someone who super duper did not have a shirt on who really needed to be wearing a shirt Ultra leave so bees can see. Wait. <laughs> Wait, what am I doing? Oh, it's the whole reel? You guys want me to leave? Iceland volcano erupted again. Or we like IRL, like actually. Don't leave, please. I'll probably have to leave to go eat or something or pee later, so. You're still around, you'll see it. Okay. Let's 
scuba equipment. Dude, this game is so addicting. I'm surprised the washrooms aren't dirtier. Okay, we do need to get the workshop. Five or six snorts and one clip there. Which one? What time zone am, am I in? Ah, uh, I am in North America and it is late. That is all, all I disclose. <laughs> I used to be a little bit more open um, with my time zone and vague. I guess, no, I guess if I shared my time zone, that's a very vague indicator of where I am in Canada. Uh, but yeah, no, I, it's like, unfortunately, I had to stop because people started getting really weird with like Ultra. We had this really bad windstorm. Did you also have this bad windstorm? Hey, Ultra, we lost power in our city. Did you also lose power? Like, just people trying to pinpoint where I am. Even though I, I've asked, like, these set individuals multiple times, like, please stop asking me this. This makes me really uncomfortable. And people just, like, did not... People just were not respectful, so... Oh my goodness! Stop! Merkle! Coming with a raid! Welcome, welcome, raiders! Hope you guys are all doing well tonight! The mercs are raiding the gas station! Oh my god. Well, we gotta we gotta welcome you guys in. Hold on, do we still have ads up? I think ads are done, right? Listen. Okay, are you guys ready? Oh no, crap! Are you guys in an ad or not? <laughs> Raiders, let me know if you're in an ad. If you guys are not, we'll we'll chat. Oh my goodness, Gilby, so good to see you. Welcome. Ads just started. Hey, oh my god. So it's reawaken and convert, co covert, covert, covert top. Wait, Covert Op Sniper. <laughs> I can't say your name. Thanks for the follow. Welcome. Um, hope you guys are doing well. No ad here? Okay, here we go. Here we go. Are you guys ready for this? I'm going to give you guys the warm welcome, okay? Raiders, do we push this button? Yes or no? Merkel, how are you doing? It's so good to see you. Welcome. If you guys don't know who I am, my name is Ultrasaurus. I am a mixed race Canadian streamer. We play simulation games here. And tonight we are playing the new DLC for Gas Station Sim. Do it. Do it. We're gonna press. Th we're only gonna press this just for the raid. All right. This resets the cars. I hope you guys are happy. I hope you guys are happy with that. Um. But yeah, we play sim games. We play all sorts of sim games. The police officer running like this. <laughs> also. Uh, we've learned that we have weapons in this game. By the way, I can shoot people with this and i can also blow myself up into the sky it's great Raul, thank you so much for the follow um but yeah if you guys don't know merkel oh my goodness if we could get a shout out for her please guys check her out she's fantastic she's amazing she's so beautiful an amazing content creator does a lot of amazing cosplays for her streams too um you started horizon forbidden west that's a new game isn't it that's a new release the little cosplay hope you're enjoying gas games station sim Marco, I'm having too much fun. Like, like, what am I, what am I doing here? Um. Oh my God. Wait, I didn't know it did that with the cars. He's still going. Oh my God. <laughs> this is the best thing ever. I'm a menace to society. Oh my god, he's going all the way to the volcano. <laughs> what did I miss? This is now an FPS. It's a now an FPS. I oh my god, Kamergle. I know. Have you played the original gas station sim, by the way? Is this the same game? Yes. Bro, this is so wild. I think this makes the volcano angry when we when we do this though, hey? You have fallen victim to your own ego. What am I doing? I'm shooting people. And before others can 
Yeah, great. No one gets gas here. Not without my permission. Thank you. Uh, Merkel, what are your plans for this week? What are you going to be streaming? What are you going to be up to? Guys, seriously, go and check her out. She's like one of the sweetest, kindest, most amazing people on this like platform. Um, I love hanging out with her and her community. She's just like such a cozy corner. It's just, just, just good vibes. Really good vibes. She plays also like a lot of games like uh, Skyrim and oh my god, I've been there for you. Ooh. Oh my goodness, please correct me. Were you doing Fallout at some point too? I think you were doing Fallout as well. She plays a whole variety of games, a lot of like RPGs, adventure games. It's, it's really, really great, fantastic vibe. She was also doing like The Walking Dead. Um, it was like a, what was it called? Uh, oh my God, I can't remember the name of those games. They're like, the games where you talk and you make choices. I have two ultra tabs. <laughs> Um, but here, I'm just gonna show you guys real quick. Uh-oh. Okay, I might have to clear the area. We might have to accidentally do this again. Telltale, yeah, thank you. Defined, hey, it's good to see you, welcome. Okay, we, we gotta reset everything. Oh my goodness, Hypno! Coming in with the tier one stuff for three months, my dude, I appreciate you, thank you. Gas station simulator, I think this angers the volcano. It's step, dance, step, pivot. Are you trying to piss off the volcano? <laughs> yes. You know, and I'm not judging you, but I'm just saying. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Every, everybody else is gonna. Whoa. I'm gonna try to take off the volcano because I want to show you guys what this looks like uh, when the volcano gets mad, okay? So the volcano doesn't like it when we litter, by the way. Does not like it. Apparently littering is bad. I don't know if you guys knew that. Um, I didn't know that. I've just been- I've been throwing all my garbage in the ocean this entire time. IRL, by the way. Um, the solution to pollution is dilution. That's why we dump everything in the ocean. Uh, Duck Red sinks the follow. Don't dump things in the ocean, by the way. That's a joke for stream purposes. <laughs> but that is genuinely- by the way, that's what happened for the longest time. People thought the ocean was this, like, massive- like huge volume unending thing so yeah we can dump all of our all of our pollution into the ocean and so for the longest time um people would just like industries would just dump all of their waste into the ocean but it turns out no the ocean actually does have a limit for how much pollutants we can put into it and so now now we've goofed it we've goofed it um A lot of screaming happening in game right now. I really appreciate you. We're screaming her streaming Horizon Forbidden West and cosplaying as Alloy. Oblivion VR streams. Oh my god, Oblivion VR streams. Stop. I still have to see that. So Gas Station Sim has a cannon uh in this DLC, yes. Love that the cannon has Shark Worker on the side. I know it's great, right? Merkel, that sounds amazing. If we can get guys one more shout out for Merkel for coming in here with a lovely, fantastic raid. It's great. <laughs> Marco, we seriously appreciate you so much. Thank you for being such a lovely, fantastic, um, amazing individual. I think the rocks can go into the ocean. I think we confirmed that last time. Yeah, we kind of goofed it. We've kind of goofed our, our playthrough a little bit. Stop yelling! I think it's crazy when storm drains just dump straight into the ocean. Yeah, I know, right? Expecting something like the grocery store game, but there's a volcano. <laughs> yeah, the TLDR, we're playing gas station simulator, tidal wave, and the goal of the game is to not piss off the volcano. You can throw rocks? You can throw a lot of things. I can, if I really wanted to, I could, I could say, go away cars. Wait, hold on, that's not working. Where are the other cars? Here. I can say, wait, I don't want this car here. So get, go, shoo, shoo, scram, get out, out, out. It's great. Hey, Can't remember, will you be going to TwitchCon US? I think so, Merkel. I think so. Not confirmed, but I want to. I really want to this year. Are you going to go? <laughs> Am I going to meet you in person? Is it going to be like 
the most amazing worst thing ever because like I just feel like we're gonna be like really good friends do you know what I mean like when the universe just has like two like amazing people come together it's just like like we can't contain this amount of like awesome sauce here within this like enclosed space you're gonna go oh my god <laughs> Yeah, I'll I'll post on my socials um, when it's confirmed. Uh, Dunk has actually taken the time off for us to go to. So, who's who's phoning? Time for the fun fact of the day, little nerds. Oh dear the God. volcano is the third angriest thing on planet Earth, <laughs> only behind the A10 warthog and that one honey badger curly <laughs> trained for missions with the CIA, then promptly <laughs> lost track of. What? <laughs> <laughs> Last reported sighting of that honey badger was an orphanage in Medellin. F's for the orphanage staff. F's for the orphanage staff. Oh my god. I think it's what a what, what, what? Hold on. TwitchCon hype. Let's go. Pretty sure Curly, you're going to, right? You're going? I'm so sorry, but I did promise Merkel a three hour hug. I will pencil you in after that. You know what, Curly? I'm just glad you have time for me in your schedule. That's okay. So I think a stream that should be having you pass out pretty soon, if I'm not mistaken. Wait. Oh! Wait. What? I feel like I'm missing information here. Also, uh, Merkel, I know that you've just streamed for a while and you've been streaming late. I would love to have you hanging out with us, um, but just, like, know there's no pressure if you gotta get out of here. You gotta walk your pet goldfish, you gotta feed your pet rock, you gotta you gotta do some things, you gotta sing to your succulents. Um, just just know that that's okay and we just appreciate your face and appreciate you and you yeah, I'm always okay with people raiding and running. I'm so bad sometimes with doing that too. Sometimes I'm like, I feel guilty. I'm like, I can't leave, I can't leave. And I need someone to I I need someone to yell at me, ultra go to bed. I think Curly did that to me like actually like a few weeks ago. She was like, you need, you need to go to bed. <laughs> Correct. Yes, I do. The wigging and removing contacts from my eyes as we speak this vibe, and I appreciate you, Marvel. Appreciate you. Curly does that to a lot of people. I need to be yelled at. I'm a, I am a friend who, like, I need, I need a little bit of some, some, a strong voice to be like, ultra, stop. I have really, what is it? What do I have? I have really uh, bad self-control. I think that's what it is. I don't have the ability to tell myself ultra no. Nice. You were like, I have a meeting in three hours. <laughs> what did I do? I I went to, it was like a D. What, oh, what was the type? What was the meeting? D escal violence and de-escalation training in the workplace um and it was really you know it was really great and it was really informative and i think what was like really validating for me is the fact that i went to this training and i was like oh i already do all of this stuff like i already know how to do this um which is really great and and made me feel like like hey you, you, Ultra, you're on the right track. You know how to de-escalate the things. You you can make the people less angry, right? I think this trash can is like getting in the way of How do I guys how do I pick up the trash can? Can I do that? I don't know how to do that. Sleep is important, gotta get that beauty rest. Dude, I I don't sleep very well. By that I mean I don't go to bed at good times. Two types of meetings at work. Why we don't have drugs and what to do about it and pizza parties. <laughs> One of those sounds a lot more fun than the other. Try the cannon. That doesn't work. I reawakened. Thanks for hanging out. I appreciate you. Have a good one. We'll catch you later. I work in a hospital pharmacy. Wait. Hold on, we have- Oh, that is so confusing. We have a beaker in chat, and we have a bleaker. You guys both have red usernames. Oh my god, beaker, I thought you were bleaker. Hi, thank you for the follow. Welcome. That is confusing. 
Why is there a gun? Because there's a shark that shows up that you need to tell it politely but firmly to go away with the cannon. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. We don't we he, we don't kill him. We just you just give him a bonk on the noggin and he comes back later to eat the people. Is that on purpose? That is a weird question because honestly, sometimes I actually, it's a, it's a really bad coping mechanism that I have. So guys, just so you know, I deal with like a lot of depression and anxiety and I've like, um, dealt with a lot of like loss in my life as of lately. And, um, some nights like it hits me harder than others. And, um, it's not healthy and I don't condone this, but sometimes I actually stay up as late as I possibly can because when I go to bed it means that I'm not lying there stuck with my thoughts it means that when I go to bed I promptly pass out because I'm so tired I usually don't that doesn't happen very often but yeah sometimes the bad sleeping stuff is is actually very much on purpose it's the healthiest least healthy thing I do does that make sense really I appreciate you um, it's, it's not good and I, I don't, I don't like recommend it, but like out of all of the possible coping strategies that I could do, it's probably the least unhealthy one out of all the unhealthy ones that you could be doing. Hey, Those are supposed to be hugs. Them. Thank you. I appreciate you. Oh, speaker. It's all good. That's a mood. Chris Games, it's the follow. Dude, I've been there. Doc, thank you. I do that far too often too. It's, I'm so sorry that you guys feel that way too. It makes me feel a little bit better knowing I'm not the only person who who does that, but I'm also sorry that you guys have been in that situation. What you drinking? Fun juice. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, um, guys, we, we often talk a lot about mental health um, in this stream. We don't shy away from it at all. Um, and I guess when it's topical, I'll share my experiences with it. Um, Usually give like disclaimers in chat before we do, just in case people you know, aren't okay with hearing about it. You know what was funny? You know what triggered me really badly the other day where I was like, I'm leaving this stream. I can't be here right now. Mana, Mana is getting married like less than a month after me and he started talking about wedding planning <laughs> in his stream. And I'm so anxious about my own wedding planning and getting stuff done. I was like, bro, I can't be here right now. I'm like, this is stressing me out. And he wasn't talking about, he was like excited and talking about like great things and like this, 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 and that. Like it was a very positive conversation, but I was like, I just couldn't stop thinking about all of the planning that I still needed to do and all of the money that I still need to spend. And I was just like, oh, I'm out. <laughs> God, see you later. I'll be back in a bit. Anxiety, but well, it's just, it's not association. It's just like, it's, I don't want to talk about I'm a little bit, I think the wedding planning is in a little bit of a better, like, place now that I feel a little bit more comfortable. Dantair, thank you so much. Oh my goodness, you guys are so sweet. Uh, Sentine Cookie, thank you. I do get you on that. I stay up because I don't want the next day to come for, oh. Yeah, no, it's not fun. Depression's not fun. Unfortunately for me, um, my depression, um, it's, I'm pretty sure it's genetic. Or I don't know what it is, but it's I've I've been dealing with depression since I was like 12 years old. Um, when I was 12 years old, I felt horrible about myself and I didn't understand why. And it took me years to figure out and realize that like, oh, it's like, oh, it's depression, right? Um, but it's something that Sometimes if there's stuff in my life going on, it makes it worse, but things could be perfectly wonderful in my life and everything is going so well and I'll still feel absolutely horrible. Um, I've learned to become self-conscious about it and recognize, become better at recognizing when that's happening so that I can do things to help myself out. But um, I, think, I think that what actually helps me and what actually brought peace to me is knowing that the depression isn't being caused by anything and that it's out of my control and that it's just it's just a part of my body and 
it sounds weird saying that. It sounds weird saying, I know that my depression will never go away, but that actually brings me some peace, knowing that, like, this isn't my fault. It just happens. It's it's just like when it rains outside, I have no control over the weather. I have no control over whether or not my depression hits me or not, right? And I find peace in that. I find peace in that. Wedding planning sucks, man. Yeah, it does. And so I don't know if that, like, helps out anybody else in chat, knowing that, like, it's okay to have depression and like you're not alone and you don't have to be fixed sometimes sometimes that's not even an option um the best that we can do is is try to dig ourselves out of the hole when we're when we're down in that pit of despair and say what oh my goodness you bari coming in the tier three sub bro thank you so much i appreciate you thank you how you doing have you tried not being sad? It's just like, bro, you don't, it's, it's a chemical thing, right? You can't help it. First streamer for me that acknowledges that. Oh, of course, races, of course. Yeah, it, it is what it is. And there's nothing, there's nothing wrong with feeling depressed. Therapy helps. So I think, yeah, out of all of the things that I've done, Curly, um, counseling and therapy have been the number one thing that have helped me with my depression. I still get depressed. There's no, there's no solving it. There's no curing that, but, but it helps me. Um, it gives me the tools to be able to help myself better, right? Just a ongoing thing. Okay, what do I need to do with your vehicle, ma'am? Do I even have the tools to fix your car? I don't even think I do. Uh, what am I? <laughs> Hold shift to highlight parts. I don't even have wheels. How am I supposed to fix your stuff if I don't have the? Oh my god. Okay, you stay right here. You stay right here, ma'am. I'll fix your vehicle. Yubari, I appreciate you, friend. Thanks so much for supporting the stream, my dude. Totally looking through houses for sale that I could maybe possibly afford, and there's a Lego Tie Fighter in this one photo for houses. Their ups and downs, down flares are not bad. They're just like, yeah. I think the biggest thing, Curly, is like, it's just like recognizing when it's happening, right? Like, man, I don't want to see my friends. I don't want to like groom horses. I don't even want to play video games. I want to lie in bed all day. And, oh, 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 right. That's the depression. Instead of just being like, feeling bad and everything sucks it's like no 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 there's a reason why you're feeling you know awful right now okay we gotta buy some parts let's buy i don't know four four let's buy four of everything if we can okay. is it okay to ask you a question discord yeah, Reese. So, um, you can either, so two things, if you want, if you feel comfortable, you can ask me in the Discord server. If you're not comfortable with discussing it in the Discord server, you are welcome to DM me. I'd open up the hood and go, yep, that's an engine all right, and close the hood. I can actually do car repairs, by the way. Fun fact. I've learned to become a car person. Hey, Ultra, where are you at in terms of Partner Plus points? We're done. We're good. We got Partner Plus, dude. <laughs> so if you want to support the stream, you're welcome to. But but we got Partner Plus. And so if it's like out of your means um, and you just wanted to help with the Partner Plus, that's okay, uh, Dante. I appreciate you just hanging out with us. You don't need to sub here. Drowning yourself in people who don't have the expectations for you to always be. Oh, my God, Curly. That's such a big thing, too. It's like, I'll tell Dunk. Hey, I'm feeling really bad today. And he's like, is there anything I can do to help with that? I'm like, nope, I just wanted to share that I'm feeling bad. And he goes, okay, well, let me know if there's anything I can do for you. And that that is so helpful. That is so helpful to know, like, hey, I have someone here for me. They're not trying to fix me. They're not trying to solve the problem. I just needed to let you know I'm feeling bad. Yep, thank you for sharing that. Yeah. Hugs are nice, too. Rule, it's so good to see you. Depression, depression is such a jerk. 
in that when you're on the down depression likes to get in your way of getting help with your oh 100 100 right because you're less likely to reach out to people and socialize Merkel, thank you heading out to my family's pup for a walk can we get one last shout out for Merkel? i know you've gotten so many shout outs but i love you so much <laughs> Miracle came in with a lovely, fantastic raid, guys. Seriously, go and check her out if you are not familiar with her. She is a wonderful, absolute gem of a person. Um, Merkle, you have a good night, and we'll catch you later, friend. My friends are super understanding if I back out a plan. Oh my goodness, Nim, that is so important, too. I once had a... Well, they were a friend. I had a friend where... Um... <laughs> where I... I'm not even sure it was necessarily depression but I canceled plans on them because I was really tired and I was like, hey, I'm so sorry, I need to nap. I need to nap. And you know what? I need friends that can appreciate a good nap, okay? This is really important to me. You don't appreciate a good nap. We can't communally nap together. I don't think you're really my friend. But anyways, I canceled on this person saying, I'm so sorry, I'm exhausted, I need to nap. And they just unfriended me and never spoke to me ever again. And I was like, well, Charlotte clearly doesn't appreciate a good nap. Oh my goodness. Merle, how's your Stardew Valley playthrough been going, by the way? Ooh, twins. Um, Hog Merkle or I'll swivel at Drongo. Oh my god. Oh! <laughs> oh no, absolutely, Fazerp. And I, I appreciate friends that have the, the the comfort in saying that to me too. Like, hey, I'm not I'm just not down for hanging out today. You don't even need a reason. Just, I'm not up for it. Okay, cool. No problem. Thank you for letting me know. No, no, Yubari, they get mad. They get mad. They don't even think it's a freebie. They just, for some reason, they think that, I don't know what it is, they think you, oh, what the? Did you just summon him? Furley, did you, how did you? You just summon this man? <laughs> Stardew's great, guys. Check out Rule. He's a good friend of the stream. He's been doing a lot of Stardew Valley as well. We raided into him the other day. Rule, thank you so much for letting me raid and run, by the way, because that was, um... I was very tired that day. I was like, man, I can't even stay awake. I need to keep my eyes open. Wow, Curly, way to bring the lurkers out. Way to call out the lurkers, okay, ah, Curly? I... No, I don't really feel like it. Hey, Curly, I don't know if you know this, but it's just not good Twitch etiquette, okay? To call out lurkers. I don't know if you knew that. How do I work on the car? Why is it... Not letting me... Oh, we don't have the thing here yet. What? Didn't I buy the car part? Am I crazy? Drunker, how you doing, by the way? And yeah, Rule, it's always good to see you in here, friend. I think I'm Dunk. Hey, Dunk. I think I'm slightly allergic to the thing you put in the drink. Like, super slightly. Yeah, my tongue's like tingly. And like kind of numb. I don't know. I'm just letting you know. I'm just I'm just sharing that like I might not be able to breathe in like 30 seconds. I don't know. Uh, it's not swollen. It's just like numb. Yeah, it's weird. I'm probably fine. Ooh, I'll just check. Thank you. Where is the stuff? Workshop. How do I? Oh, that's how we do it. Oh, okay. Okay, this makes more sense. I understand. So do I do that? Okay, that's how we do it. Uh, but Drongo, how are you? What have you been up to? Oh my god, I totally forgot we have the Twitch etiquette command. <laughs> oh, that's so toxic. <laughs> Bro, you gonna add Curly and you gonna Twitch etiquette her? <laughs> okay. an absolute gong show of a stream. I feel I need that. <laughs> Woo! Uh, but yeah, guys, check out Drongo. I don't know if we got a shout-out for him already, but if we can get a shout-out, if we haven't, that'd be nice. Drongo's an amazing, fantastic streamer, by the way, guys. He is just such a good friend of the channel. Um, someone who I just trust so much. Um, he is... Uh, definitely a streamer that I look up to and I hope to one day like I just I look at him and I look at his stream and I'm like Man, you're fantastic. And I, I always try to like 
when I try to look at myself and try to become a better streamer, I definitely like look up to Drongo and like try to pull elements from his stream to like be like, ah. what, what is Drongo doing that I ah. that I could be doing better? Ah. Dude, I know someone who hey, talked like listen. that sloth and it drove me nuts. Beeps, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate you. Drongo is amazing. No, absolutely. He is just such an inspiration, like 110%. Um, oh, wait. Both the mirrors broken? Both the mirrors broken. Drongo, are you still working on your... Um, ba 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 uh, We're multi playthrough. Ultra, you look up to any tall streamer. I don't need to be live tonight. I don't. I didn't. I don't know at what point when we started hitting the short jokes, but I don't need to be live. I don't need to be streaming. Yeah, Gord, go go for it. Absolutely. I don't need to. I don't need to be here. You guys know that, right? I don't need to sit here and face this abuse. Okay. <laughs> uh. Actually, wait, Curly, how tall are you? How tall are you? I'm four foot eight ultra. You tower over me. Don't worry, I'm a short king. <laughs> You're five foot eight. Oh my god. <laughs> Curly, Each you know how tall I, I am, right? Here, I am abused. People always think I'm like average height or taller than average because I think I have like big personality. Um I am I am not a tall person. Are we showing our verified list now? <laughs> <laughs> then just remove the phone books and we won't be able to see you anymore. You y'all are rude. Y'all are rude people. I've seen pictures of you next to Queen. Okay. To be fair, though, Queen is really freaking tall, though. Like, we're on, like, exact opposite sides of the spectrum. Like, he is a very, very tall man, and I'm a very short person. Like, I'm used to, I'm used to people being taller than me, but when someone comes up to me and I say, Oh, you're tall. It's like, yeah, you're really freaking tall, man. Whoa, super. That's okay. That's fine. I just wanted a little bit. Thank you. Queen is, I think he's stunk. How tall is Queen? He's like 6'4", isn't he? Yeah, he's closer to, he's probably closer to 6'4", dude. Okay. He has OBS. Don't bother that man. <laughs> Jesus. Are you open? I'll have a Krabby Patty Deluxe and a double chili kelp fries. Can't stand women being taller than you on heels? Well... That, that, that sounds like you're a very insecure person. Um... <laughs> I don't, I don't know what you want me to say to that. That's just, that's, that's a you problem. That's a you problem. I was worried you'd be stranded. Tall women are hot. All women are hot. Where am I? I gotta repair cars still. Okay, what are we what are we doing here? I'm I'm pretty happy with my height. I think the only time in my life that I've 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 I that I've felt like regretful or upset with my height was when I was um wedding dress shopping because wedding dresses are not meant for short people. They are built for people with longer torsos and longer legs. And I found something that worked for me. I found something nice. But like, man, it's like, it's just kind of rough being short and trying to fit into dresses that are just not built for short people and their proportions. That's the only time in my life I've ever been like, 
I guess. Ma ma is mad the right word? Just, yeah, just not happy about my height, I guess. I was like... Are you allowed on roller coasters? <laughs> I hate you so much because sometimes they actually make me stand next to the stupid stick to double check. I actually hate you so much for that. <laughs> it was an honest question. I am tall enough for roller coasters. But the attendants sometimes question that, and they 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 go to check. Thought it was five foot four for years, but according to two doctors' offices, I'm actually five foot three. I am, I think, without shoes on, I'm five foot even. Oh my god, Nim! No way. If your feet feet reach the ground while standing up, you are the perfect height. That is true, Gord. That's very true. It was an honest question. Drongo, do you want to wait, Drongo? You don't like mayonnaise, right? You don't like mayonnaise, right? Curly, I'm sure you absolutely rock it in heels, by the way. You absolutely rock it in heels. I think, like, one of the saddest things that I've seen is, like, like, I've known some really, really tall women in my life, and, like, they would intentionally, like, slouch and crouch, and, like, they were just really... They, like, you could tell, like, they were just very embarrassed by their height. And it's just like, no, you're so beautiful. You are so fantastic. Like, stand up tall. Stand up tall. Um. Wait, I can't remember. Like, I'm trying to remember the mayo debacle. You're not, like. Drongo hates mayo. Should, guys, should I show Drongo the same thing that I shared with Pete? Six foot three. Whoa. You hate mayo? Drongo loves it. Why don't gas stations play hide and seek? Because good luck hiding when you're pumping out that much gas. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> okay, Drongo, are you ready? Are you ready for this image? I'm going to show you an image, and even if you like mayo, it's disgusting. You ready for it? The joke is that I adore mayo. I'm gonna show you guys, I'm gonna share an image on stream. Are you guys ready for this? Not this again? What do you mean, not this again? Yeah, this is a new DLC, uh, Fox Thief. It's great. It's really fun. Six foot three and six foot four. Oh my goodness. Some tall woman. Okay, ready? Okay, I'm gonna share. I'm, we're gonna share this with you guys right now. I, I'm actually gonna go to Quiet's Discord to pull this up too. <laughs> I saw it. He really hates mayonnaise, and I immediately thought of him. Uh, where did I share it? I shared it in here. Okay, you guys ready for this? Why is this so zoomed in? Oh my god, stop! We want to give a huge congrats to David Woodall from Somerset, Kentucky on winning our Hellman's Mayo Challenge. David was able to finish all six cups within our three minute timer, completing a challenge that had been failed every year since starting it in 2008. This man, six cups of mayo in under three minutes. Beeps, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Debo is a legend in the Mayo community. What about it? <laughs> this, I was just near someone said, oh my god, scope. Did you stream today, dude? I saw you were playing uh, your game earlier. How are you? <laughs> dude. Like... Does this, this man looks like he's seen some shit though. Like, like, oh my God. Okay. But like, <laughs> bro. <laughs> Good and day off. Right on. Um, if we can get a shout out for Scope, I would really appreciate that guys, by the way. Scope has been a like super, super long friend of the stream. Him and I used to play dinosaur survival games together back when dinosaur survival games were not shit, for lack of a better word. 
Uh, he's been playing a lot of Ghosts of Tabor. I don't know if you guys know about this game. It's really neat. It's like completely VR. It's like a FPS game. And he's got all the gear and everything to basically like... Play. It's, it's basically Call of Duty VR. Dinos, I know. Um, but guys, he is, uh, he's actually getting kind of close to being able to apply for a uh, partner. Um, and he's, he's a fan. Dude, actually, hold on. Biggest selling point. Biggest selling point, Scope. I'm so sorry. You're going to hate me for this. Biggest selling point to follow this man, Scope OG. He is literally like Dr. Ian, Ian Malcolm adjacent. He, no, he literally looks like Dr. Ian Malcolm is streaming on Twitch. I'm not even joking. This man, like, <laughs> Scope. Guys, follow him. Check him out. If you guys even want to lurk in a stream, uh, help him out. He is fantastic. He's amazing. Um, I totally 110% support him. <laughs> I've shared that with you before, right? Have I not ever said that to you? Wait, I, have I never shared that with you? I Okay, now I don't even know if I've actually said that out loud before. I might not have. You don't think so? Oh. <laughs> Yeah, dude, no, you seriously. <laughs> okay, if others have, like, you seriously, like, 110%. He's Twitch's Dr. Ian Malcolm, okay? Guys, check him out. He's fantastic. He's amazing. I, I really do support him as a streamer. Um, Jesus Christ. <laughs> this explains the follow gif? Oh, my follow gif? I like Dr. Ian Malcolm, yes. Oh, stinky garbage. Get that out. I had no idea it was Scope. Yeah, we actually, believe it or not, guys, we, the follow gif is actually Scope. We had him, like, next to a green screen and everything, 110%. Yeah, of course. Yeah, Scope, I hope you're doing well, friend. Uh, we gotta repair cars to go to the next, like, level up a Rooney thing here. Drongo, did you do your, was, uh, but, but, but the last stream you did, I was a little confused about it because I've never seen the game before and I'm sorry I missed your stream, but the game that you streamed last, was that for the thing that was being promoted on Twitter with um, FG Squared and Kiri? Quick, someone follow so we can check. <laughs> yeah, guys, scope is super easy going, chill. Like, good vibes all around. It's, he's, he's always been a streamer that I enjoy hanging out with, no matter what game he's playing. VR game I play is, oh, is it more like Escape from Tarkov in VR? Oh. Dunk, you might like it. Um, sorry, I didn't realize that. I, I, I just, sorry. Wait, I feel like I heard you mentioning, like, scavs and stuff. Am I wrong? I, oh, you might have said that during your stream, and I totally missed that. Yeah, oh my god, I totally heard you. Yeah, okay, sorry. More more Escape from Tarkov VR adjacent. This, yeah. <laughs> we played a Dune RTS game. It was super fun. That sounds amazing. Wait, what's a moon pie? Isn't that like a... Isn't that like a wagon wheel? How much Dune lore are you familiar with? Zero. I have not seen any Dune. You can sue me for that. Can't use it right now. Yes, I can. What's a wagon wheel? It's like a chocolate Twinkie disgusting snack thing. It's a chocolate coated biscuit with marshmallow and jam. Yes. <laughs> Curly, it's late for you. If you gotta go to bed, go to bed. Dude, you're such an early riser too. Like, goddamn. A lot of it, I swear to God, a lot of my conversations with Curly, it's like she's woken up and I haven't gone to bed. Wagon wheels are mid. Bro, everything is mid to you, Drongo. I s <laughs> everything is, what is not mid? Drongo, please tell us, what is not mid? It's a wooden spoked circle, often clad in iron, that fits on a wagon's axle. Lord. Don't you start. Mayo, avo, <laughs> dumplings? 
Yo, 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 whoa, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What type of dumplings? Just, just so we're all on the same page here, what type of dumplings? This is important. Dumplings could mean like pierogies. I think pierogies are dumplings, right? It could mean like, um, Chao Long Bao. Or wait, what is it called? Chao, X, XB, XBL, X, XLB, Chao Long Bao, yeah. I need to be honest, but I'm down for steamed or fried salad. Nice, nice. Yeah, I think for me, um, steamed dumplings are my jam. Dude, I love dim sum. <gasps> I want dim sum now. I'm so hungry. I have dim sum. I have chung fun. Oh my god. Gotta go eat that. You love soup dumplings? Curly, I love that you knew what I was talking about. I love that I love that you knew that I was talking about soup dumplings. That's like amazing. XLB, baby, let's go. I you know what? You know what? Controversial take. Soup dumplings are mid. <laughs> I like other dumplings more than soup dumplings. <laughs> huh? Dunk says you take that back. Fried gyozas are your favorites? I love... I think my favorite dumpling is probably sumai. Like, uh, the pork dumplings and, like, the hagao. This is the shrimp dumplings. I also like the um, beef chongfan, which is, like, a rice noodle wrap with, like, beef and sauce and it's so good oh oh i'm getting really hungry this is a problem i'm japanese so gyoza is kind of mid for me <laughs> Fudu, what's your favorite japanese food then as a as a japanese person what, what what's your go-to i mean to be fair like i think like i think like the non like hype things i guess like maybe that's why i kind of find like xlb mid right because i'm like everybody has it all the time like for me um a chinese food that i really love is uh jok. it's also known as kanji it's like a rice porridge and it's oh my god it's so good especially like it is my go-to hangover food it'll settle if you're sick you're hungover it'll settle your stomach real quick it's like the same, it's honestly like very similar to like, like what you would feed to like your pet if your pet was throwing up, right? Like just give them rice. <laughs> give them rice porridge. Naan? Naan is Indian, East Indian. Just cause something is everyday doesn't mean it's mid. Um, I'm not, uh, well like when I say, Sorry, every day is not what I meant. It's more like popular in restaurant culture. If you're like, because I would say like, like jok is very much an everyday food in Chinese culture, but it's not something that like people normally order if you're not Chinese at a restaurant. Five pound calzone, what the? Voodoo, oh my god, dude, thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate you. Thank you, thank you. Fresh tuna sashimi is my favorite food. My dad used to go fishing a lot, so we had- <gasps> Oh my god, that would be amazing. That would taste amazing. I love that. Curly, what are you, what, what is, what is something that you eat that, that says home to you? Like, what is, what is the dish that you eat that you're like, this is my comfort food? What's, there's a Japanese dish that I really want to try that apparently like foreigners don't really like. Um, it's like the fermented, it's like fermented beans or what is it? It's, uh, I can't remember the name of it. Huh? It's not bean curd. It's not tofu. Uh, natto. Yeah. Oh, no way, Drongo. Yeah, I want to try it. Is that veneer? Oh, no way. I 
That's your comfort food? That sounds delicious. Okay, God, you guys have made me way too hungry. It's a place near me whose calzones are the size of a large pizza folded in half. That is crazy. Um, I need to be right back because y'all have made me way too hungry. I'm going to eat some chung fun and I'm going to be right back. Have some mayo. You have some mayo. You've learned to make it yourself. Oh my God. Oh my God. That is amazing. Be right back. All right. And we're back. What am I doing with... Okay. Haha, ha, what's up? I am hanging out front of the Circle K right now, sucking down a chili dog. What you doing? Here, thank you for the tier 3 sub, dude. I appreciate you. I'm hanging... Are you okay? <laughs> How you doing? It's good to see you. You're fine? Okay. Nice millennial pause. Uh, I you can edit that out though, right? I did that, bro. bro what do you mean? What is a millennial pause? I don't know what that is. I genuinely don't know what that is. I don't. I don't know what that is. Yeah, dude, that was, uh, I mean, it was live on Twitch. What was the game in the clip where you were in the tractor? Uh, that's SnowRunner. Waiting for the video to start and then talk? Isn't that, wait, what do you mean? I'm so good. Isn't that what you're supposed to do? Why would you talk before a video starts? I don't understand. What? Does Sumer start talking instantly? The Zoomer, the cool kids prefer starting their videos mid-sentence. I'm so confused. I don't think I've, I've never noticed that. I've never noticed that. Oh, okay, gotcha. No, I, I, I don't know. I'll have to pay attention now, but. Not anything I've ever noticed. Have a good night, Curly. Hey, Curly. Uh, get a Curly. Get a shout out for Curly on our way out. I appreciate that. Curly, I appreciate your face. God, you didn't have to say. I, I gave you a shout out a long time ago, dude. You you didn't have to be here for this long. I appreciate you though. Have a good one. We'll catch you later. <laughs> See you later. Oh my God, JK Ray, redeeming the VIP. Let's see. You're right. I sh you, honestly, you really should have. You really should have. Let's see if we have any um, VIP slots left. We might not. No. So. JK, right? I need to go through the list of VIPs. We actually are currently capped out. I need to ask someone. I need to find out which VIP has been the least active in stream. And um, once that happens, I will I will VIP you. Is that okay? Oh my goodness, JK, right? We got you. Hey, BC, how you doing? Uh, Bink, are you in chat? <laughs> it's Drongo. <laughs> And welcome again to Team Mayo. I make made sure to publicly welcome you as well at Girl. <laughs> Reese, how are you doing, by the way, friend? Got a death fenestrate an old VIP. Oh, I get that reference. 
Another VIP? That means we gotta remove someone. Think, are you still in chat? See you later. You know what I might do, guys? Oh, the volcano's mad. Why are you so mad? If I get an upgrade, it gets less mad. You're not a VIP? Do you want to be demoted to VIP? What do you mean? What am I gonna- Oh, we're back at 60 frames. Now we're good. That's so weird. No, JK Ray, what we do is- we, we already actually talked about this on stream not too long ago. Essentially, if people haven't been active for a good chunk of time- I'm not saying- I'm saying like over two months if they haven't said a single thing on stream, uh, they're getting shuffled out. Um, and I made this as a disclaimer for everybody, so... Uh, you want it refunded for the moment? Uh, just keep it for now. Um, I'm sure there's someone who hasn't been around here in a long time that we can- that we can shuffle out, so... Well, I mean, you can get VIP again. You just gotta hang out and, and redeem it, right? It's just- it's kind of like... I mean, it's the only reason why Drongo even bothers saying anything in chat and comes out of the lurk, and he's- he's gotta make sure that, hey, I'm still here and I got VIP. <laughs> Drongo, I heard the other day, apparently, there are some streams that do roll calls at the beginning of stream, and they take- and they check to see who's in chat. And if you miss, like, too many streams at the beginning, you get, like, banned. Isn't that wild? Roll calls! No, I appreciate that, Foggy. No, it's all good, dude. <laughs> Roll call. Who's still here? Oh, it's just insane. It's just insane. That's a fun roll. Yeah, I think we've done actually a, a few joke roll calls at the beginning of our streams. But, like, the funny thing is, like, I'm gonna flat out say it. That's- that's a very small streamer thing. No one who is partnered, no one who has, like, like, a substantial viewership is ever going to do that. It is literally only- you're only ever gonna find streamers who are, like, just starting out or have, like, a very small audience that are gonna do that. No one else is ever gonna do that. Like, I'm just- I don't know. I don't know if that's, like, like, a hot take or not, but I'm just, like, it's just- oh. With roles like that, I assume the streamer either no longer streams or has wised up by now, and uh, you would think so. Why would they do that? It's the same reason why streamers um, ban lurkers. So there are some streams where if you lurk and they call you out and you don't say anything in chat, they ban you. Like, I'm dead serious. Next time I'm doing a roll call and you better be there, Ultra, or it's gonna go on your permanent record. God forbid. It's just- Oh no, the volcano's pissed! Oh my god. <laughs> Look at them running. <laughs> oh! Oh my god. Volcano is very mad. Fine, guys. It's fine. Everybody stay calm. Banning lurkers sounds like a stupid idea. It is, yeah. It's essentially, yeah, kind of what Gord is saying. It's like smaller streamers are trying to grow their stream, but like they're just kind of choosing strats that are not actually good strats. They didn't like my break, apparently. Krakatoa is gonna blow. Krakatoa has blown. Yeah, no, I appreciate lurkers. I love our lurkers. Y'all wanna lurk? It's totally fine. We have a few resident lurkers um, that I super... Drongo is one of them, actually. Drongo is definitely like a hardcore lurker in here. Um, the man comes out of nowhere with like redeeming the VIP and I was just like, <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> 
My Wonder Woman throwing these rocks. I am the Hulk. Okay, we need to buy. Ooh, this is dirty. Oops, not fuel. Sorry, I want scuba diving stuff. And surfing stuff. I clean up the shop. I need an employee. I really do. Star for non family social interaction. I mean, Nim, that's fair, dude. That's fair. Size of Volkswagen bugs. I know, right? Or uh, Volkswagen Beetles, sorry. Clean? Clean. You know what we might do, guys? I might actually, um... I'm gonna save the game. Save game, tidal wave, empty slot. Save? Is it saved anywhere? I think that's what it is. It's challenge five? That's awkward that it doesn't differentiate it from the other safes. Which are all auto saves, by the way. Oh no, these are all the tidal wave. Okay, so base is different. These are different saves. Okay, that makes me feel better. We're gonna quit and we're just gonna restart the game because I feel like it's memory leaking a little bit here. Uh, Bink, I had a question for you. Um, do you mind just sending me the names of the three people who have VIP who have been the longest outside of um chat. Uh because JK Raid redeemed VIP. So I'm wondering who I can boot. You guys can disagree with me and again, like it doesn't really matter. Like people can run their streams the way they want to run them. It's not my call. It's not my say. Um, thanks, Pink. But I think having a follower only channel is like so detrimental when you're growing your stream. Um, personally, as a streamer, I will not raid into you if you're a follower only. If I'm a new viewer coming in from a raid, I'm not going to follow those streams. Uh, Supermarket Sim is a different game. But no, like, I, I just, I personally, and I, I know they have reasons for it, but if the goal is to ever grow your community, it's just not the way. And I think that some people feel like it forces people to follow in order to chat. But for me, I'm just like, no, I'm out. I'm out. See you later. But that's the thing, though, Nightwolf. That's why we have, like, shield mode. If you have issues with, like, hate raids, you turn on shield mode, right? But yeah, anyways, I mean, I'm not telling people what to do with their streams. They can do whatever they want to. I just, I don't agree with that personally, unless like you have a, for me, it makes more logical sense when you have like a really big stream and chat's like really hopping and it's like, yeah, you want to control how much people can actually chat in your chat. Um, that's my, that's just, that's just my opinion. Oh, this is running so much better. Yeah, there's definitely memory leaks in this, hey? Eh? Oh, that's a big rock. <laughs> I don't think I threw these very far now, did I? Your game is leaky. Yeah, it is. No, Chucky, I do the same thing too. 
No, exactly, Zeta, exactly. I think that's, for me, that's when it makes the most sense, but I'm not gonna tell people how to live their lives. Aren't hate raids usually bots? Not necessarily. Honestly, the real meta for full-time streamers is sub-only chat. Make sure people have to pay to chat. Min max is profit. <laughs> Drongo. <laughs> I, you know what? Uh, I think I've only ever been in one chat that required you to have a sub chat, but it was like very like valid. It was like, yeah, this checks out. This makes sense. Oh my God, dude, that's so funny. I'm such a crazy person that even when I'm doing wheels and video games, I'm like, no, you gotta do the star pattern. Man, this game is shit. I think I'm going to uninstall it after. I don't think so. I think if it was crap, I wouldn't be playing it four hours later. Wonder how Osmongold makes his money on Twitch. Uh, for the by the way, like so, the majority of money that like streamers make, by the way, is like a large chunk of it actually comes through like sponsorships and deals. Hey, you notice the star pattern? I gotta do it. <laughs> it's how you're supposed to do it. Um, a good chunk of it does come from Twitch, but like a lot of people don't realize how much of it comes from like outside deals. Who's Asmongold? He is one of the top streamers on Twitch and or like top World of Warcraft streamer. Thanks, Poggy. Appreciate the lurk. Thank you so much, dude. Appreciate it. The star pattern makes me happy every time you do it. It's how you're supposed to do it, though. <laughs> you got to do it that way. It's how it's done, right? Can I hire people yet? It'd be really nice if I could hire people. Okay, we need to buy more fuel. We're super low on it right now. Delivery, fuel, all of it. Yes. Please. Have a nice day. Streamer money comes from Raid Shadow Legends. Oh my god, how much stuff are you buying? Amazing. For this financial year, sponsorships have been 30% gross income. 30% gross income, uh, Twitch 50%, and the rest is YouTube, Patreon, direct tips, and etc. Working on Twitch to 30% is my biggest priority. Yeah, right on, Drongo. Right. That PP really helps, though, eh? Am I right? PP team, let's go. <laughs> Nothing wrong with the big streamers. Right? Ain't nothing wrong with that. Okay, we need more alcohol. We need more. I don't think people are buying the cigarettes. I think we need to put this somewhere else. Somewhere, I don't I don't know. Here. There. This is your inner self saying you should play ATS. Nope. PP is huge. It's huge and it's huge, right? We need more ice cream? We need more ice cream. So we need ice cream and we need alcohol. And hold on. What else do we have? Uh, car care and newspapers. We don't have that either. S 
Um, so we need... And... And... That... Oh god, already delivery on the way. Huge! It, yeah, ATS is great. We're gonna be playing it when the new DLC comes out. With all the releases of games as of right now, though, it's just like, I, it doesn't make sense for me to be playing ATS at the moment. But yeah, ATS is a great game. Same with uh, ETS 2 as well. What's ATS? It's American Truck Simulator. It is a game where you drive trucks. <laughs> it's, uh, it's as self-explanatory as it gets. It's a truck driving simulator. ETS 2? No, they won't have that. Dude, the fact that they're still updating ETS 2 and that game is old, they're not gonna... There's, there's no way. The delivery products... This Oh, I... They get... They got rid of my cart. The jerks. Hmm... I buy all that? An impossible delivery on the way? I don't think there's a delivery on the way. That's a big fat lie. I... It says returning from the gas station, so do I just... you guys know this about me but the worst way to get me to do something is to tell me to do something even if i wanted to do it now i'm like oh i definitely don't want to do it now and it, maybe i don't know is it a fault is it a negative thing about me i don't know but it is it is something about me that i have not a lot of control over and i am the way i am and if you want me to do something don't tell me to do something because it's not happening then just, I'm just throwing that out there into the universe. Just, just tossing that out there. I'm just, I'm a really stubborn person, man. You really do have sim games about everything. Dude, they have paint drying on wall simulator. They have chair sitting simulator. Rule, I know, right? No, ETS2, sorry. ETS2 and ATS. Whatever you do, do not drink water. <laughs> Is Tanner being nice and, and caring? Does Tanner actually want me to drink water? I don't drink water, by the way. I'm an absolute donkey and a half over things, like, like truly. Ultra, can you please put the channel to sub only? Mode? Bro, you're not even subbed. Are you annexing yourself? What do you mean? Strong <laughs> is like, I don't want to be present here anymore. <laughs> I don't want to be here. <laughs> do they have a playing simulator simulator? Dude, I'm sure there is. I'm sure there is. Ooh. Last two days without any accident on scuba diving and surfing sands? Oh, bro. We're on day nine, and this is the first time. You should get off this game and play ATS. Chat is demanding it. Don't shoot the messenger. I don't think they are. Drongo, he wants to not talk anyways. Oh, dear God. Well, see you later, Drongo. <laughs> I'm paced. It was nice chatting with you, dude. We'll see you later. Oh, do we have a bot in chat? We might. Shark sighting! Get the cannon! Oh my god, I'm gonna shoot it. I'm gonna shoot this rare, endangered, beautiful beast. Where is it? 
Oh, I see it, 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 I see it. Oh my god, I'm gonna shoot it. No! Don't! Did I get <laughs> I'm shooting a shark! Oh my god. It's probably not dead. It's probably just sleeping, chat. It's probably just sleeping. Oh, I can't, okay, we can't go that far. That's not a thing, that's not a thing, that's not a thing! No! <laughs> surprised the volcano is, I'm surprised the volcano isn't mad about that either. Oh, Drongo, I don't know if you saw earlier, but bro, look at the, look at the shower costs. <laughs> <laughs> you can't respond because you're timed out, but like, bro! <laughs> you will? Literally, dude. Shower to watch with me! <laughs> are there even peepholes? Oh, there kind of are. My real voice reveal. A bigger. What do you mean? What do you want? What do you want? How jacked is your character that can just use a cannon like it's a rifle? Very jacked. How much do I owe you? Oh my god, they're buying so much stuff. Thanks. I need to hire people, please. This is too much work for one person. Wait, did someone, did someone to, what? Oh, time out. Yeah, they did. Now, well, if you're going to go into his chat, you're going to be banned now, dude. You're not even going to be able to chat there anymore. That's okay. <laughs> okay. Do I have? I have newspaper soap. No, don't sell that. No. Did I buy newspapers? I did not buy newspapers. And then I can fill up the scuba place too, because I don't think they have scuba masks anymore. No, they don't. At all. There we go. Here, back guys, gotta go shoot a shark with a cannon. <laughs> yeah, just no big deal. It's fine. Casual. Happens all the time. So we need to buy We have that, we have ice cream. We need more drinks. 
We're good on snack. Fish. Go outside. And we need drinks and newspapers. Right? Newspapers. Oh. There we go. Most normal gas station around. Well, I thought so. And we've gone over this. You lose VIP. It almost feels, I feel like I'm crazy, but it almost feels like the progression is like a little bit easier on this map. It's still challenging, but I feel like I'm not as bankrupt as I normally am when I play this game. Oh. Bye, see you later. Uh, that was weird. Neat. Okay. Uh, what else can we buy in terms of upgrades? Warehouse level three. Oh my goodness, guys, thank you so much for that hype train. And Tangi party? Are you kidding me? You guys, we're actually kind of close to um, becoming partners with Tangi, by the way. Thank you guys for the hype train and for the Tangier party. I appreciate y'all. It actually fits the vibe of the game. It really does. <laughs> Some good shopping music. I know. Lee Mac, giving you the 200 bits, dude. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Whoa. Gifting us up to me, Lena. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. That was really nice of you. Thank you, thank you, dude. Y'all are amazing. This is fantastic. I know, right? So, just so you guys know, we are, I think we're officially affiliated with Tangia. But if you guys are interested in getting us partnered, let me see how far away we are from that. We are currently level 19. And we need to be level 22 to get partnered. I don't know what that means. But anyways, just throwing that out there into the universe. Wait, so this is all new. Oh, it's so much bigger. Whoa. Neat. This is still not cleared out yet, but... Dude, this is so much spiffier and nicer than it was before. This is nice. This is really nice. Chumway, my day was alright. How are you? I just need to hire people to do this for me. I really do. Just as I wanted. Have a good day. See you later. Hi, how are you? That's good. The best, only the best. Chippy chippy. Okay, we're gonna buy more parts for the garage. One, two, three, four, five, six.
The worst? The best. Dude, the best. Okay, clearly needs a new tire. I feel like that's how you know someone actually knows something about cars though, right? If they do if they do star oh my god. If they do star style with doing the tires, it's like you know. If you know, you know. The star. No. And of course, they're like not pork to spec, right? <laughs> Oh my god. The night wolf asked me, should Tanner be timed out? Oh, probably. Oh, yeah, dig it. If Tanner's stirring up the madness, stepping into the ring with bad vibes, he really then it is. might just be time for the big time out. I think yeah, so too. Yeah, just like in the squared circle, you gotta know when to lay down the law. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> New beach map? Yes. It's a lot of fun. Great. Hmm. Why isn't anyone... Is this bugged? They should be using it. They're not, though. What we might do, guys, is I might, um, we'll save the game again and we'll reload because, um, that should be saving. And I'll do a full, I'll do a full, um, reload here. Oh! <laughs> See you later, Nightwolf. <laughs> Y'all have way too many channel points. Y'all have way too many channel points. You have more points than you know what to do with. Let's see, now it's working. I didn't realize it was bugged. See, can he get back there? Yeah, he's happy. Oh, we had a customer die. Oh no. That's the worst. Anyways. <laughs> Newspapers do you need? Thank you. How did the customer die? Because I sold them, I gave them faulty gear to go surfing in. So they probably drowned or something, I don't know. Great job. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. I did not kill them. They drowned, okay? That's not my fault. That's not on me. Okay? I take zero responsibility for drowning. Uh, upgrades. Okay, so we need gas station level four. Oh my god, it's so big now. I'll oh, bake the gas station. Is this a great use for it? Um, I've used the cannon for a lot of things, but maybe do you want to let us know, Tigerin?
I don't- maybe I've already been doing it. I don't know. This doesn't look that much bigger. Maybe it does. Oh, it's not. We didn't upgrade this. We upgraded the other thing. I guess we meant discreet. Uh, yeah, we've done that a little bit, Tigran. We've done that a little bit. Someone in chat told me to fire it at the ground and I did it. I was like, sure, why not? Oh my god. Customer at the garage. Apparently enough people have used the showers that they're pretty happy with that now. All right. Oh, is that it? Is that all they needed? Well, oh, that was it. Easy. Put a shirt on. Uh, I don't know how much I've been making off the showers. I think it's one dollar to shower on your own, two dollars to watch, and then ten dollars to join someone. Anyone is buying the cigarette. Uh, okay, so now we have access to the hat shelf. Last shelf. And we can purchase our car care stuff. Uh, we can purchase some hat, maybe. Last. The game is, uh, uh, wow, I can't afford all of that. That is unfortunate. Oi. Normally costs a lot more at Luffy's place? What does that mean? Hey, Jet. How you doing? See ya. Welcome. Okay. Workshop. Let's go. Ah, oh, doing all right. Doing all right. Can't complain. God, all the wheels need to be replaced. Are you kidding me? How did you even drive here? Uh, Marcus, I'm really liking it. It's good. It adds enough, like, new mechanics and variety to the game um, that it definitely feels very fresh. It's good. It? That was it. Okay. 
You're welcome. See you later. That guy has a solid mustache. I'm gonna go over here. We're gonna refuel this boat. We're getting a little low on fuel, but we'll be okay for a little bit. That. Okay, later. Let's see if we can, um... By like, I think there's like bathroom upgrades and stuff that we can get as well. Oh, apparently the showers are absolutely disgusting. What? Where? Where is it dirty? It's allegedly, apparently, super... I don't see how it's so dirty, though. What? Where is it so dirty from? Oh, maybe... Does it mean that? Do I need to... Do I need to clean something? Like, I don't understand. Why are the showers so dirty? Is it a bug? Uh... I don't know. I don't know why it's so dirty. I genuinely don't. Incredible. I don't know. Okay. Get some more upgrades. Did I scan that? I did. Awesome. Upgrades. Let's just upgrade the the toilet. Additional toilet. Now there's two shitters. Great. It still says it's super dirty. I don't know. Why am I carrying a pirate cannon to blow the pants off of a shark? Why else do you think I would have one? What do you mean? Dude, I actually don't get this. Is there... I... <laughs> I don't know. Because the bathroom's not even nearly that dirty. I would not shower in there. I would not shower in there, no. You need... <laughs> Okay, we need more fuel.
We also need to start doing like car wash stuff. So I think we're actually gonna store. Nice. Goodies, can we get the fray? Welcome, how you doing? Insert generic raid messenger. How are you? How was your stream? Tell us all about it. Thanks for coming in here. I appreciate you. Raiders, how are you guys doing? If you guys don't know who I am, my name is Ultrasaurus. I play simulation games. I am a mixed race Canadian streamer. And, um, la 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 la. We are playing the new Tidal Wave DLC for, um, gas station sim, and it's a lot of fun. Great. What were you playing? Firing day and boardwalk RP. Very, very busy. I'm ready. Oh my god, dude, please go to sleep. Rest stop. Um, thank you so much for coming in for the raid, dude. Uh, if we can get a shout out for 2Ds, I would appreciate that. 2Ds, thanks so much for coming in here. Bye, dude. I really do appreciate you. Um, <laughs> get some sleep. We'll catch you later, my dude. We'll catch you later. Thank you. Why is everyone stuck here? What the heck is going on here? Go! Oh, that, that'll do it. Mirror, mirror, attire. Thank you, Judy's. I appreciate you. Thank you, thank you. You get yourself some good sleep. We'll catch you later, my friend. Thank you so much. I played electric car simulator yet? No, I didn't even know that that was a thing. The lighting is really weird in this game. It's like actually kind of hard to see. Like what's going on here. Have a nice day. Are you done? Okay. It is power wash sim. Pretty much. Feel okay. That's awful. Deal with that real quick. Running, running. I couldn't reach something. <laughs> With a bit of supermarket sim. Supermarket sim is great. Fact my customers coming in though, I feel like it doesn't. Maybe it does. Ice cream. There's a snack here. Drink. Oops. A 
That's fine. Yeah, I mean, this looks pretty decent. Uh, we should purchase some of our car repair stuff right now. The game looks a lot better when it doesn't have that like artificial lighting to it. What's wrong with this car? What else? Mirrors and both the- oh my god. Yeah, both mirrors. I don't know why it wasn't letting me do the mirror. Great. Fine. Almost at the next uh, challenge. Right. Like your joke? What was your joke? Addicted to Stardew Valley? So I guess there's no party buses in this DLC then, hey? I guess if anything, if there were to be something, it'd be like a cruise ship or something. Have a nice day. Hopefully cat off them where she throws and I can't face them. Bad joke, poop. I do like the system for warehouse stuff here better. Um, I really didn't like having to open the garage door for the truck and having to close it and yada yada yada. This is a lot easier for sure, in my opinion. This DLC is a lot of fun. 110%. I'm really enjoying it. Yeah, it's great. That should be done. There you go. There you go. Oh my god, it's so dirty. What 
What did you do to your truck? Lady? Okay, let's upgrade something. We have so much money, we can upgrade something. Plus four, maybe? Gives us an increased field capacity. This looks better too. Equal plans for the weekend? Probably just streaming. Do. Oh my god, this guy. Brutal! Buying so much stuff. Great job. Uh huh. That'll do. Hey, John. It's good to see you. Have I, for I forgave Pippa right away, dude. She's a cat. She's doing cat things. I would not be a smart cat owner if I was not expecting the cat to do things like that. So. Is whatever to me. We'll bring in a diamond from a chest. You can, oh, that's actually pretty progress. Yeah, I think the bathroom is just forever scuffed, guys. Like, I don't, I don't think there's anything that I can really clean in here. Unless there's like some mechanic that I'm not understanding that I need to do. Like, I just, I, there's nothing in here that I can really change or do. A little, oh, what is this? Oh, is this for the showers? <laughs> oh my God, what? Oh my god, please don't tell me this is for the shot. Oh my god. Bro? You know how easy this is for me? Do you have any idea how easy this is? This is a joke. Please tell me this is for the car wash. I think it's for the car wash. I don't think it's actually for the showers. Right? <laughs> yeah, the pump's outside, which is nice. Need to buy more surfing equipment too. Can anyone look up why the showers are not like clean for me? Does anyone mind doing that? belt so that it runs faster. Delivery product. We want more surfing stuff. It's expensive, so we're just gonna get four. Um, oh, right! We have the hats and the other thing. I didn't purchase. We could have purchased. 
forgot to do that. Yeah, it, it just cleans it so that it runs faster. If I can show you if you want, if you want to pay attention. Um, like if I leave it, it starts to get like kind of gucky. That's a stand. Um, that can go. There. And the hat stand can go. I don't know. That's fine. New level? Yeah, this is a new uh, DLC for, um, for a gas station sim. It's pretty fun. I'm really enjoying it. It's good, it's good. Done. I'm so sick and tired of moving the wheels. <laughs> Oh, that's all it needed, though. Oh, that's great. From the desert to the beach. Yep, you bet your bottom. Clean this up a little bit. It'll be a lot easier once we can hire employees to do all this for me. For sure. Uh, it's not too bad having to do it on my own, but as the facility upgrades and grows, it's definitely for like much easier to have hired help in this for me instead. Yeah. I'm gonna to purchase more fuel too. Uh, yeah, I think it's supposed to be kind of Hawaii-based, from what I understand. It's funny, we haven't actually had a shark in a while. <laughs> I'm fine with that. Oh, nut. They get so upset with that, too. Okay. Delivery, fuel. How much can I afford? Not that much. Oh! Oh, wild. How do I reset? I didn't realize that the cost of fuel changed in this game. I mean, that makes sense, but... My I ban tenor yet? No, not yet. Faster rumor gets spread between sharks? No. How fast? Reawaken! Thank you. And I was banned? No, not yet.
God, these tires are so messed up. Did I wolf you back, buddy? Uh, I actually, yeah, I have played Car Mechanic. What did I play? Car Mechanic Sim 2021. It's good. It actually really, really helped me a lot with my learning of like the engine and car parts and how things connect with one another. It was great. Done. What else do you need? Oh, oh God, you actually need oil. Okay, I don't have oil. You know, break comes me now. <laughs> How much do I owe you? I don't get that at all. The volcano's getting really mad, hey? I'm gonna try my best not to clean the conveyor belt, though, if we're still in chat, you can kind of see. It's like visually getting dirtier, hey? Parts, tires. Give me 10. Hold on. Oil. Yeah, look at how slowly it's moving now. So if I leave it, it just kind of... To some degree, like, honest to God, when they, like, order a bunch of stuff, sometimes it's nicer that it goes slower, but... excited I'm gonna biff him where is he he's over on this side no don't eat my customers Be gone. Seen that coming? Tanner getting timed out? Pretty on far. Yeah, having a good one, Harbase. Thanks for hanging out. Appreciate you. Catch you later. Anyway, so yeah, when you clean it, it clears up. It's like nice.
Okay, we're pretty close to completing all of the objectives. Need an oil bottle to start. Ah, uh, where does that go again? Yeah. Go. Uh oh. Oh, so it just has to be in between those two points. Great. Oh! Like, it almost over pours, okay? Good enough. Get out. Cars repaired, cars washed. I'll buy way too much stuff. Enjoy fishing, Tanner. <laughs> the volcano is going to explode pretty soon, by the way. Just so you guys know. What is wrong with your car, sir? Okay. Hopefully it's just the one tire. I think I did buy more, but. I know, pretty quickly. Yeah, I, I did, I got more. Uh, what else is wrong? Z -Z okay, we gotta stop sooner than we think we gotta. Like here. <laughs> Thank you, see you later. Have a good time. We do need to buy more oil though, real talk. Yeah, no one's buying the uh, cigarettes right now. The cigarettes and are what I mostly need. Three. Well. Oh, dude, that sounds like, yeah, it's, it's pretty resource heavy, isn't it? And there's been timed out four times tonight. Are we being a little mean? I don't know, Tanner, what do you think? Is it unjustified, my friend? You tell me. I, I'm gonna leave Tanner to be the, the judge of that. That's it? What do you mean, that's it? Okay, cars repaired, cars washed. Oh, is he still timed out, bro? Hey, Alex, how you doing? It's so good to see you. Welcome, bud. How you doing? Have you ever been into the gas station sim sort of series? Great. Apparently he isn't fishing.
I like how it's like, ready, get set, go! And I'm like, oh, God damn it. I, yeah, Alex, I don't doubt that. I, I mean, I've seen the games that you've streamed. I'm like, dude, I... <laughs> we have very similar content. <laughs> guys, check out Alex. He's a fantastic streamer. Did you guys know that he's Canadian? Does, did his name tip you guys off? Maybe. Uh, he does a lot of uh, very similar games to us, guys, by the way. Um, he plays simulation games. Fantastic content creator. Very chill. Easygoing. Streams a little bit earlier in the day than us. Um... Would recommend y'all check him out and say hi to him. What am I? What am I missing? Oh, the oil. The oil. Oh my god, we gotta go get it. Yeah, Alex, I hope you've been doing well. This is the uh, the new tidal wave DLC. It's pretty good. I'm enjoying it. You can do, there's so many shenanigans that can be done now with this DLC. It's great. Oh, of course, Alex. Of course. Happy to support other fellow. Not even. Canadian streamers, Canadian sim game streamers, of course. Multitasking to the mountains. Whoa, whoa! <laughs> Hello? What what is that stupid Tangio thing? <laughs> the guy underwater. <laughs> the last DLC I tried was the airfield one. I wasn't a huge fan of the airfield one, hey. Uh it was fine. It was nice, but like it just felt like it felt like added work versus like added content, if that makes sense. I think the airfield is also in this DLC too, by the way. Super. Yeah. There's a, yeah, there's a lot of us Canadians, whether you like it or not. For better or for worse. How do you like- oh, I'm loving it. It's great. Highly recommend. Absolutely. Uh, it's a lot of fun. They've added a lot of, uh, new mechanics and new buildings. I feel like the progression just feels better in this game, too. Instead of an uh, angry mafia uncle that threatens to break your kneecaps, there's just an angry sentient volcano that wants to, like, explode all the time. <laughs> Arguably could could be better or worse, I don't know. Are they bugged again? They might be bugged again. Yeah, dude, it's it's good. It's good. Oh Nim, are you yeah, Nim, I think he mentioned that last time too, that you're Canadian as well. I totally remember that. Nice. Or alcohol. Okay, cars repaired, cars washed, boats field. We're almost there, guys. We're almost there. Great job. Uh, I don't know. I've met some crappy Canadians. The string of new games you've been playing lately, like this and Supermarket Sim, do you think you'll be trying things like firefighting sim, snowplow sim, construction? I've done- Wait, John, come on. You've been here for construction sim. Haven't you? Yeah, I- I'm- Because I'm streaming more full-time now, John, I have more time, 110% to, um, to branch out and, um, play more games and expand a little bit. Yeah, I have played construction sim. Yeah. The volcano is happy. Oh, joy. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm more open to playing more sim games as long as they're refined, you know what I mean? Like, they're just not super scuffed. I don't want to play super scuffed sim games. Oh, okay, gotcha. Uh, I still haven't played Lawnmower Sim, and I, I would like to play that. Um, I don't know if that sounds, like, kind of nerdy or what, but... Uh, yeah, Lawnmower Sim appeals to me. I actually, you know what? When I was... How old was I? When I was eight years old, my dad taught me how to mow the lawn, how to start the lawnmower, how to like fuel it up and take care of it and this and that and use it. And I was really proud of myself. And I loved mowing the lawn because like you would never see in the neighborhood, you'd never see women mowing the lawn, let alone like a young girl, right? So I took pride in it. I was like, hey, yeah, hell yeah, I can do this. And like dad do, does this, I do this, this is great. I really, really liked it. Turns out I'm really allergic to grass, though. Cut grass, so I, I no longer could really do that. But I do quite enjoy, like, the concept of mowing the lawn. And so, I don't know. If I ever came back to it, like, I would I would definitely, like, at some point love to play that game. I don't think we will play drug dealer, Sam. It's just not... It's not the vibe. <laughs> It's, it's just, it's not quite the vibe. It's fine, though. Oh my goodness, Alex, it's so relaxing. I've run into the bunch of the scuffed ones lately. Yeah, I, I, I feel like the scuffed ones are pretty obvious that they're scuffed, though, you know? Just, just my, just my humble opinion. The, that's the door scratcher thing. Nice. Okay, we just need to wash one more car and fill a few more boats and then we're good. And we can go to the next level. No, I don't think it's me, and I find joke fans funny. I also ha asked for half of mine tonight. <laughs> just Tanner, I'm just checking in with you. I know you can take it, but you know it's 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 also just good to to check in. You know what I mean? Sometimes, sometimes the joke to the the person getting the butt end of it might not find it as funny anymore, right? Hey, real estate skim. Real, I can't talk. Real estate. Sim. Uh, yeah, to be quite honest with you, Alex, that one looked scuffed to me. Uh, I, I looked at it and I was like, no. Nope. <laughs> so that doesn't surprise me. Adult entertainment establishments have to- oh, dear god, what? Wait, did you go there for fun? Like, in-game? Or did you, like, was that a part of the real estate you were selling? Great. No judgment, no judgment. <laughs> Are we on a 40 second delay? You shouldn't be. Does it sound like you are? It also depends on how quickly I... Oh! Risky, were you here from when I was streaming in my parents' basement, dude? Dude, no, I'm home now. I have internet again. We're good. We're Gucci. I need more hats. Oops, that's gone. No! <laughs> you botched it. I wanted to check out the places and goodness grief, there were some sketchy places. <laughs> What's the <laughs> What's the rating of your stream? Do you mind me asking? Like <laughs> Are you <laughs> Are you normally a family friendly streamer or like and and you stumbled upon those places or are you like 18 plus? Cuz <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> but it'd be a lot funnier knowing that you're like a family friendly streamer and you just like stumble upon those locations and it's like okay well that's awful thank you 
<laughs> Great. Yeah, let's buy some more da 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 da, da hat. 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 I am. I try to keep family friendly. I am so sorry, dude. That's I objectively that's really funny, but I am so sorry. <laughs> oh no. Stuff are you buying? Don't get ultra started on catfish. Wait, what do you mean? Oh, like the fishing stuff? That'll do. That'll do. I think the volcano's like getting very, very, very mad at me. Pretty mad. Pretty unhappy. Guys, I'm just gonna um, run to the washroom and grab myself another drink. Uh, we're gonna be going for like another hour or so here, so uh, bear back real quick. Solid bug, by the way. It's, dude, it made me so uncomfortable reading it. I got so incredibly squirmy and I was like, dude, I can't read this. I'm like, this is, this is so, <laughs> for lack of a better word, I'm like, this is so naughty. <laughs> oh, oh no, we're good. Sounds hilarious. No, mm -mm. no. Okay, what else do we have here? We need we need snack. Oops, sorry. Uh we need snacks, we need car things, we need alcohol. Snack. Car things. Alcohol. Did I buy all that? Delivery is on the... God. I didn't realize I'd already bought something. Awesome. All the... Oh my goodness, Wasteland Puffy, thank you! How are you? It's so good to see you. Ah! Uh, I think I already said that, but Celtic lover, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate you. Wait, do you like, do you like Celtic culture or you like Celtic people? I got it. Sorry, I just got to clarify. <laughs> no, it's a, oh my God, Alex, go to bed, bro. Oh my goodness. I'll catch you later, dude. Thanks so much for hanging out. I appreciate you. Need to haul more debt bill tomorrow. Oh, neat. Fun. Oh, Alex, you own a diesel, don't you? Bro, just take some of the jet fuel and put it in your, your car. Easy going. Free gas, dude. We're gonna get cheap gas in Alberta, though. We'll catch you later. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out. Have a good one. See you soon. <laughs> yeah, fun fact. You can put, like, jet fuel in, in diesels, by the way. If you didn't know that. Me too.
The author also wrote a B movie, Smut Fiction. I would honestly be more inclined to maybe also read that too. Maybe. Maybe. Big maybe. Bet. <laughs> I I don't know. I don't know. I just I feel like the B movie would be more wholesome than ogres, right? I suppose you can put anything in combustible in a diesel. I don't know. All I know is you can put jet fuel in there for sure. It's like frowned upon, like heavily frowned upon, right? It's like a big no-no, but you can definitely do it. Okay, we just need to fuel one more boat and we can go to the next level. Add it to the list. If you can, Tanner, you, s you link me a link to it on amazon.ca, I'll add it, okay? Subby wubby. Ooh, woo, 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 woo. Subby wubby you woo 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 woo. I hate that so much. Mine! Oh my god! Can we get the tier two sub? Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Mine. Oh my goodness. Well, who? Senti and Cookie and mine. Y'all are amazing. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you so, so much. I hope you guys are doing well. Oh my goodness. Thank you guys for this. Aha! <laughs> the support. I almost fell off the edge there. Sorry. Mine, I hope. Mine, are you okay? You doing well? I feel like I haven't seen you in a little bit. Hope you're doing okay. Yes! We can level up now. Yes, yeah, station level five, baby, let's go. We're gassing it up in here. You need to get my sleep? No, it's all good, mine. All good. You you are welcome. You could you could abandon us for a whole year and you would come back and it'd be like, goodness gracious, it's good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Don't ever apologize for not being around here. I just wanted to make sure you're okay. There's no pressure to ever be here. Anytime you are hanging out with us, I appreciate the time you spend with us. It's no obligation. Ultra, if anyone in your family watches cricket, tell them today is IPL. Gotcha. Oh, that actually made me a little sad. I'm so sorry. Um, <laughs> I do have one family member that watches cricket, but they can um, no longer watch TV and or take care of themselves. Sorry. I, that, I, Jet. That was, thank you for the heads up. I appreciate you. That was just an accidental sad moment. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Upgrades. Uh, let me upgrade the, sh can we upgrade the shower? We can upgrade the toilet. When can I, when can I hire the people? Hire employees, houses. Oh, this is how, yes. Oh my God, I didn't realize you had to buy them a house. Hire, oh my God, who are we hiring? Guys, do we hire Charlotte or George? Oh, never mind. George is the clear winner. Absolutely not. Yeah, we're getting we're getting George. George is going to. Hi. Why are you resting? George is gonna fuel cars. What does premium mean? I didn't realize that that's how that works. <laughs> what did he just do? Okay, this is gonna go by so much faster with hired help now. Holy moly. 
Holy guacamole. Okay, the shower is now fully cleaned, by the way. I don't know. What. Just weird stuff, man. Hey, listen. Are you guys messing with me? <sighs> Out of all of the things you guys do on Tangia, I know, I swear to God, that one rustles my jimmy so hard. Out of all of them, that one ticks me off the most. Because I go to look and they go, who's following me? Who just followed? And then it doesn't load. And I'm like, is my OBS broken? Is something wrong? You feel good about yourself? Do you feel good about yourself, Nightwolf? Oh, it's brutal. It's brutal, Bank. Nice. Oh! Refuel 100 boats. Hell yes. We're sure as heck good. Okay. So now that we're level... All right, we need to purchase something. We need to purchase... We would have one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's just get six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Did you guys see my post in venting, by the way? God, I was so irritated. I was, my jimmies were so rustled today. Holy guacamole. Basically, for those of you who are, in chat, who are not in the Discord or not up to date, I've just been a little irritated because, um... Because people, um, decide they can come and go as they please in this community. When I say come and go, I don't mean, hey, you're here and you're lurking and you leave for a few months. I don't- I, that doesn't bother me. That's fine. You, you lurk and you come and go as much as you want to. Like that, that's fine. When someone physically unfollows or leaves the Discord server, right? Like you've left, you're gone. And then you come back when it's convenient for you because you want some more attention and affection from me. And that's when you decide to come back and you start, you start like reaching out to me for, for, whatever it is you need in your life i'm just like get out get out of here you did not need to leave the stream you did not need to unfollow you did not need to leave the discord and the fact that you've come back here and i'm just like dude that's not how that works absolutely not being absent for a while that's fine that's okay physically leaving and then coming back no. I have nothing. I have no problems with people doing that in itself. There's no problems with that. But don't don't come to me expecting the same level of friendship and empathy from me if you do that. Is all I'm gonna say. Okay. 
Where's George? Who is George? Let's hire another employee. <laughs> Hi, Bear. I guess we have to hire Charlotte. That's fine. She's good at repairing. Feel maybe I should get the employees to do the yucky jobs that I don't want to do. Maybe I should get the other guy to do um, our washing. I really don't want to do that. Bear, it's been all right. It's been all right. Hope you're doing well, my friend. Yeah, let's actually let's get you to. Can you wash? They they don't wash the vehicles. Fiso, the DLC is great. It's great. It's basically, it's kind of the same thing, except for you're in Hawaii. They added some different new game mechanics, which actually like makes the game feel fresh and good again, which I really like about that. I think like in the environment is good. Instead of an angry mafia uncle threatening to break your kneecaps, there's a sentient volcano that's just perpetually pissed with you. <laughs> it's no, it's genuinely good. We need engine oil. We need everything here. Everything. If I can afford it. Eduardo, it's good to see you. Welcome. Yeah, you can shoot people with cannons, by the way. Um, it, this is a separate save. So it's a completely different save when you do this, um, Mephiso. So you can easily swap back and forth. Yeah, no, I, I, that threw me off at first, but it's actually great. I really like that. What else do we want to do? We want to refill this. I don't think it's working. Let's see. Oh, they're working. Can this game get overwhelming? Um, mildly, but not really. I feel like there's always a lot to do, but it's never... The game isn't super punishing if you don't get to where you need to be immediately, in my opinion. It's not that bad. <laughs> okay, Night Wolf. Oh, no. 
Be mad about that. Yeah, I, I, I mean, I feel pretty relaxed right now. <laughs> I don't think it's that bad. can we get surfing car wash too what does this do increased pump durability up, battery exchange Dur ah, surfing let's do surfing okay. they don't get it for free i don't well i don't know what they what happens all i know is they get mad if you don't scan it properly. I, I know, I know, I know, I'm here. Fishing Valley, yeah. I mean, that's that's the really nice thing about the game tanners. You can you can play however which way you want to, right? There's no there's no defined way to play Stardew Valley. It's just it is what it is, right? Uh -oh, I need car supplies. I need ice cream. Yeah, and alcohol. Yeah. Alcohol. Ice cream. Our supplies. need a police hat for. What the hell? Bad about that. Azrael, good morning. How are you? Oh, Paul, we were were you here for our Sturdy Valley stream? It was really good. Uh by the way guys, we're gonna do a poll in the Discord uh for stream for uh tomorrow. Um, and let me know what do you what do you guys want to do? Um, I'm gonna put Stardew Valley as an option. Uh, yeah, you guys can vote for really whatever the heck you want. Need oil? I need everything. So okay. Dude, I love Stardew Valley. I just. I don't know how much you guys want to watch me playing it, though. Like, that's my biggest hesitancy, because it's so different from any other game that we've streamed, right? That, um, I really want to play it, but I just don't know if you guys want to see it. How was your weekend? Nice. Uh, you can automate it, yeah. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm, I'm automating things. You can eventually hire enough employees that, um, they're, they're all doing something for you. Absolutely. Variety is the spice of life, John. Absolutely, John. Thank you for still hanging out with us tonight. I know you've been here for a while, my friend. I love how you came here. Like, oh, this ain't the same stream. <laughs> and you've decided to hang out with us, and I really do appreciate you for that. So thank you. I recognize that. <laughs> John's like, 
My streamer went from a guy to a girl. Hey. Okay. Yeah, that's fine, Tanner. Good amount of money right now. I'm, I'm actually pretty pleased with it. How much do I owe you? Fortunately, um, Dirty Valley is definitely a game that I can play. Um, without people being like, you can't play this game without being carried by other people. <laughs> so I'm definitely more okay with doing... Ah, shoot. What the hell? Oh. Definitely more okay with doing multiplayer with it. It's just unfortunate that other games that I play, people are just very judgmental. This thing? This thing is broken, hey? Like, I've been trying to put it on- Oh my god, you can put it up here. <laughs> like, I'll try putting it here. It just- it doesn't seem to work no matter where I put it. the new update? Azrael, it's really, really good. I'm actually really enjoying it. It's great. Okay, I need more scuba gear. And I need more... Uh, I need everything in here. Oh, dear God. I'm sure I need more surfing gear too, so. Sorry. Delivery, products and parts, scuba diving. Just get 10. Surfing, just get 10. If I can afford that, that'd be great. Can't afford that, yeah. You should be able to- yeah, Bear, I mean, in a perfect world, yeah. It's just- it's just- it's not how it works though, right? I can't- just because I say I want to play this game doesn't mean everybody wants to watch that game, right? Everyone has their own opinions, everyone is entitled to them. Um... It just- honest to god, at the end of the day, it just comes to- It is what it is, right? And I respect that people have different opinions and- this and that. Oh. Mm -hmm. Everyone is entitled to my opinion. Hey. Top of the line job there. Okay, that's coming in. With more supplies. Your stream, you're paying the bills. Mafiso, that's the <laughs> That's that's exactly the reason why I can't do what I want though. Right? It's end of the day, this is paying my bills. Um I generally here's the thing though, like even if I'm not playing Stardew Valley, 
we are playing games that I genuinely enjoy playing, right? I'm not playing games that I just like playing here. So d don't, don't worry about that at all. But like, it's just, yeah, it's just not how it works. <laughs> That's actually why a lot of, um, so fun fact, this is why a lot of partner streamers flop, by the way. Because they think that once they get partnered, they can stream whatever they want to stream. And if that's their prerogative and they don't need to do this for a job and for a living, that's fine. But a partnered streamer who goes, oh, I'm partnered now, I can play whatever I want to, and then, and then proceeds to play whatever they want to. That's how you get partnered streamers that are on the platform and they have 15 viewers and you go, whoa, what happened? It's no, no judgment at all. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not like saying that's a bad thing. I'm just, uh, I'm very objectively saying when you see situations like that, it's because they decided to do whatever the heck they wanted to after getting partnered. And it's just, it is what it is, right? You build a community upon playing a certain type of game. And end of the day, I think, you know what? I think I'm really proud to say that a lot of you guys here in chat right now are here for me personally. You guys are here because no matter what game I play, you guys like being here. But the fact remains that there's still a large amount of people out there where um, they are only interested in seeing certain games, right? And so if you're not playing those certain games, they don't want to be around. And there's nothing wrong with that. I, I'm certainly like that in certain streams. There are certain streamers where I like them and I respect them as streamers, but if they are playing different games, I, I'm i not necessarily watching them. And there, and then on the other hand, there are other streamers where I'm like, no matter what you play, I'm gonna watch. It's just, it's just the reality with streaming, right? Sardu does have a huge following, yes, but it's very different from my regular com content, um, Mephisa, which is, which is the point that I'm kind of trying to make here. It's just, it's a, it's different. It's very different. Ooh, I think this one's more fun than Supermarket Stim. 100%. Absolutely. Hands down. No question about it. Yeah. Dude, I, I, dude, I want to get back into Zomboid. I really do. I love it. I'm actually really, really appreciative that the community is also, like, very receptive to me playing Zomboid 2, eh? <laughs> Wardro, you've been here for a Zomboid stream, right? Oh, God, please tell me you've been here for that. Oh, yeah, dude, I'm not, yeah, no, 100%. Different genres attract a different crowd, and, again, nothing wrong with that. But yeah, you're not going to see people who watch streamers who play Fortnite also watching the same streamers playing um, Door Fortress. Absolutely. Hmm. Cat, thank you for the lurk. I appreciate you. Thanks for hanging out. Will we get a cat cam? Maybe. She's... What are you doing on the floor? What are you doing there? Oh my goodness, Azrael coming in with the tier one sub, my dude. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Hope you're doing well. I'd play Fortnite if it had a Dwarf Fortress patch. <laughs> no, it's all good, Azrael. It's all good. I appreciate you, friend. Thank you. The volcano's gonna erupt soon. It's very, very mad. Fine. Yeah, I was trying to buy more um, workshop stuff. Honestly, I, I'm just buying 10 of everything. I don't even care. Actually, you know what? This one? Go 20. Can I, can I purchase that? Will it let me? 
<gasps> oh my god. You're a zombie player? Yeah, I, uh, I've i been doing a lot of, like, uh, Project Zomboid CDDA, and I've been loving it. Oh, it's so good and so painful. <laughs> Kenshi, Rimworld, Project Zomboid all follow uh, Dwarf Fortress's philosophy of losing is fun. I've been wanting to get into Kenshi, hey? Uh, I've been watching Rule playing it, and it looks really good. Are you continuing Stardew? It's up to- I'm gonna do a vote in the Discord. If you guys want to say- if someone can, doesn't mind doing the Discord command. Uh, we'll do a vote in the Discord. If you guys do vote for Stardew Valley, we'll play that tomorrow. Oh my god, Nam! The new DLC is gonna be amazing. Be amazing, dude. Taxi Sim is so scuffed, but so good, hey? Is that a boat? No, this is a dinghy. Or a, a buoy. Actually, a Nightwolf, are you following Azrael? Azrael's been streaming it a lot. I know you shared um, that other streamer who's playing it too, but... I would recommend if you're you're up way, way late at night, you check out Azrael's stream too. I have... 1200 hours of Zomboid. I'm slowly starting to survive. I've had our own server in it and it's great fun. Yeah, Borjo, it's great. I love it too. So, turns out a lot of the map has paths too small for big animals. Oh, okay. Okay. The volcano is going to burst very soon. <laughs> uh, and I'm going to need more fuel soon, too. Get a human carry a huge gorilla as cargo to get it from place to place. Oh, that's annoying, dude. Yeah, I, I've been wanting to get into it. Like, real talk. It looks really interesting. It looks a little complicated though, but it looks fun. We're getting there, guys. We're getting there. I think we can at least go up one more level before the end of the night. I think. Maybe. Maybe that's ambitious, but... And she isn't so much complicated as it is deep. I mean, just on the surface level, it looks complicated. At least to me, it does. Oh my god, the volcano's gonna blow. <laughs> Ooh, let's go. How much money do we have? Nine and thirty. Yeah, let's get let's get another um delivery fuel in here. We're getting to that point. Incredible. You don't actually control the dude's actions in Kenshi. Really? You sure about that? Can you guys hear the volcano? It's not a good sound. <laughs> I 
Cage? How are you? It's good to see you. Welcome. Yep, sounds good, Warjo. Thank you for the lurk. I appreciate you. Pool so we don't have to deal with this later. What? Oh, <gasps> you're adopting a cat? How do you know how old it is? Sorry, I asked because, like, in hindsight, now that I've owned a cat for a while, um, my next one I will be getting it differently. <laughs> you getting a kitten or you getting a full grown cat? <laughs> oh my lord. Okay, it'll be rumbling. This is my first cat ever, yeah. Dunk, Dunk hey, grew up with cats. Listen. I did not grow up with cats. I'm not a cat person. Also, if we can get a shout out for Cage, I would appreciate that. Uh, Pinyagi, thanks for the follow. Welcome. Oh, that's really sweet, Gyarados. Oh. Dude, I love animals that are senior citizens. That's really sweet. Oh, I think I did purchase the lock. I think. The pick. Here. I didn't think to do that, Tiger, and that's a good hint. Thank you. I thought that picking locks would just give you money. Here, hold on. See if we can, uh, oh my god. Quickly, clutch, do this. The non disex and non microchip stray that my partner and I found. I believe he's under a year old, though. At that, see if anyone's missing him. Oh, poor kitty cat. Is he nice? Do you love him? <laughs> any any mods in chat tonight? Hello, mod check. <laughs> He's so friendly. Oh my god, age was really sweet. Oh, I I don't know. I hope you. I hope things work out. Nice cat on. What was I doing? I was gonna buy the uh one. No, no, no. Tools. Pick. Hold on, I'm gonna steal so the volcano doesn't get pissed. Oh my god. Like oblivion all over again. Poster. Okay, we're gonna give this to the volcano. Don't blow up. No. Woo! <laughs> Take my poster. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Let me up. Does the poster not count, bro? Oh my god. What's Pippa's story? It's not a very exciting story. Anma won't let you post about cheap gas. Are you listing the name of a province, Poo? Because if you are, that's probably why it's automating you, my friend. You can say it without saying the name of the province. 
Yeah, you got it. Uh, who the reason I have that is because people would not stop trying to guess where I lived in Canada, so I've just blocked all province names and everything. Not your fault. Yeah, no, I, I, I. <laughs> Kia, Pippa story. Um, oh shit. We don't have any mods in here right now. Uh oh, that's not good here. Cage, there you go. Guys, check out Cage. She's beautiful. She's amazing. She plays Elden Ring. She plays a lot of fantastic games. I met her when she was playing Bethesda games like uh, Skyrim and Oblivion, all sorts of fun things. Definitely go check her out. Fireworks, sure. Fireworks. That's what we're gonna call it. So Pippa, basically every everyone and everything in my life was dying. Um, I'm not even joking or exaggerating. I had a lot of people pass away. Uh, that including like my grandma, who was really close to, who practically raised me, and my family dog also kind of died suddenly and tragically, and it was awful. Um, and so I gave myself enough time to grieve and to kind of not, you know, do things out of guilt. Not guilt, sorry, uh, out of out of grief and sadness. But I was like, well, I do need a pet. And Dunk had really nice cats. Um, I had met his cats. His cats were fantastic, and I was like, "Man, you know what? Maybe not." I, 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 I've been, I've had some not so great experiences with cats. But his cats have been great, so I've been like, "You know what? Maybe cats aren't that bad. Maybe cats are great. Maybe cats are nice." And so I was like, "Let's get a cat." And originally we wanted to get one from the shelter, but because it was during COVID, everybody was like adopting cats really quickly, and even if they they would only be up for adoption for like. for like less than a day and they were already getting adopted out right and i was just like okay this is ridiculous this is ridiculous like how are we supposed to get a cat um hold on you're gonna feel cars too during the night hold on feel cars and so I didn't want to adop adopt a cat from the shelter unless like I got time to get to know it because I think that's a little bit irresponsible to just like adopt a cat from the shelter day one without knowing its personality or like knowing if it had any issues or I I any incompatibilities, right? Oh, Siri. <laughs> yeah, I can carry big boulders, dude. Leave the post or other stuff in your inventory. Oh, okay. Maybe I'll put that back in my inventory then, hey? Because it looks really bad on the wall here. How do I grab things? How to grab posters. Ah, it's fine. It lives there now. But yeah, so I started looking like online for people selling like kittens. And I didn't like a lot of them. Um, I didn't like how they didn't have photos of the parents. I didn't like how they were super young and they were giving them away or selling them. Um, so I want, I was looking for a cat where you could see at least evidence that they knew the parents and that they spent enough time with the mom. And that's how we found Pippa. Um, they had a picture of mommy, a picture of daddy. And like lots of photos of her. And she looked great, and we met her a few times, and she was very eepy, so she was very well behaved. Um, the mom was, like, super smart, and the dad was an asshole, apparently. And now we have a super smart asshole cat, which is great. Um, but she was the last one to get adopt- she was the last one to get, like, um, given away. Um, uh, which should have- should have been some sort of indication to us that, like, huh, maybe there's a reason people don't want this cat. But anyways, yeah, we got her as a kitten, um, and yeah, no, she is very, very, very smart, and just her entire personality is question authority, so that's how we ended up with Pippa. I think if we do get another cat, I would like to adopt um, a cat from a shelter, um, and we just didn't really have that opportunity because of COVID, and I wasn't going to be pressured into adopting a cat instantly because 
oh, well, what if someone else adopts it first? Like, it's just like, no, I just think that's super irresponsible. Um, but yeah, so Pippa, Pippa wasn't adopted. Um, we got her as a kitten, and oh my god, she's been... Kate, she ru she destroyed my internet, Cage. The, the last thing that she destroyed, too, was like a fiber optic cord for our TV, which cost $400 to replace. To be quite honest with you guys, I think she was really lucky that she ended up with us. I think she's really, really lucky because I'm a very determined owner. And when I take responsibility for a pet, it is a lifelong responsibility for better or for worse. And holy, sorry for lack of a better word, holy shit has she been testing on our patients. Oh my God. She has, oh. She has not been an easy cat. I love her and I'm here for her. And I'm just, I'm, I, I've looked at her though. And I'm like, man, if another family had, had adopted you, I'm like, you would have ended up back somewhere. Like you would not be still at their home. There's no way. Yeah, Sarah, I think she was about 12 weeks old when we got her. She hates music only when it comes from me. Yeah, Gyarados, I tried to do my due diligence. Have a good night. We'll catch you later. Oh, Voodoo, that's okay. I mean, I'm just like, if I'm, if, if I was getting a cat from someone like off of Kijiji or like Craigslist, right? Like I just wanted to like not be getting a backyard barnyard kitten. Do you know what I mean? Where there's just like no history, no nothing. Oh, look, we got kittens. Nothing wrong with that, but that's just not what I wanted. I wanted, like, a little bit of security knowing that, like, she was raised properly. She was raised in a good environment. She had proper interactions with, like, her parents. At, le at least the mother, right? Um. <laughs> I will. Have a good night, condom and services. Thanks for hanging out. I appreciate you. We'll catch you later, friend. Cage, keep us updated on Twitter. Let us know. We end up getting kitty cat. That's really sweet. Yeah, no, you can have a really heart-wrenching experience when your animal develops health issues. No, absolutely, Pooh, absolutely. Um, it's just, it's just, it's just a mixed bag, right? You don't know what you're getting. And for me, I would rather be, I'm the type of person where I like making uh, very informed decisions. Uh, oh, and that's, that's just where I come from with, with my logic, I think, everything else. Yeah, Gage, how old was Pippa when you adopted her? I think she was at least, she was 10 or 12 weeks old. She's, she's... I don't know, people tend to adopt out animals, like, pretty young. Um, and she was definitely, like, older than what all the other kittens were going for, which were, in my opinion, they were too young to be taken away from their mother. My opinion. You have a cat in Stardew? What did you name it? Oh, that's really sweet, Shenway. Hey. So... Hello. Let's see if I can hire one other person to do the workshop stuff for me. That would be really nice. Houses. Bye. Is potato. Your farm is potato. Everything is potato. My life is potato. <laughs> Schedule. You're going to be nighttime and you are going to repair cars, please. Thank you. Yeah, 
Yeah, I saw that, Shamai. I saw that. It's really cute. My character got, like, the notification for it. Okay, we're gonna go and we're gonna upgrade something. I don't know what. Toilets? Already dead. Sorry, car wash. Just pump durability, battery exchange. Do the work. Happy volcano. We do need to buy some more hats. Also, I guess we're level five, aren't we? Can we just... Can we also buy this stuff? Yeah, we can. Pastries. Oh, I hate the pastries. They're weird. Can I buy all of this? Do I have the money for it? Correct. Man, that's <laughs> I I would not endorse that method. Cats are cats are very different. Um cats so here's the thing with cats, they actually respond best to uh positive reinforcement versus punishment. Um they're pretty fickle creatures. Um, I can, I can, I can guarantee and tell you from my own personal experience that, like, positive reinforcement works better with a cat. Um, and a lot of, a lot of websites and, and information out there will also support and back up what I'm saying too. Also doesn't chew on cords. She just doesn't. <laughs> she has chewed on the two most expensive cords in her four years of living with us. But she doesn't chew cords. Just You're just those here. ones. Cats are gonna do what cats are gonna want to do. Uh, they the way that cats work is they they definitely function better with with positive reinforcement dude they were both they were both fiber optic cables though tanner both of them she just wanted to free the laser <laughs> Do I need to buy some car batteries? Just buy some car everything's. Oh my god. Cats eating cable is like the silliest thing in the world to me because I grew up with a lab, right? I grew up with a Labrador Retriever and that thing just hoovers food. And then watching my cat eat kibble, like one kibble at a time, I'm just like, bro, this is so wild. <laughs> <laughs> Cage, where did you guys find the kitty cat? just kept appearing at the door. Oh. Poor Bean Bean. 
you guys know if you guys oh my god i shouldn't i shouldn't encourage this because like you guys don't quite know yet if you guys are gonna keep them or not but like do you know what you're gonna name them if you get to keep them <laughs> Border Collies would literally ignore their food half the time and got my first lab. Dude, labs will eat themselves to death. They will eat so much that they will throw up and then proceed to eat again. La <laughs> labs are absolutely insane. They just perpetually act like they're starving. Yeah, Nim, I miss my lab too. Usually their own throw up. <laughs> Dumb dogs. <laughs> oh yeah, I miss I I miss my miss my lap too. His are all good boy. Really real sweet man. Good heckin' chonker. I don't know, I think it's important we talk about this stuff. I think it's good to remember them and I try my best to do that because it is hard to talk about it. It really is. I miss it a lot. Great job. Catch it! Chun, how you doing? Labs are like goldfish? Sure. Oh no way, Nim. Yeah, ours was a uh, ours was a yellow lab, German Shepherd cross. So he was big for a lab. He was a little bit more golden, and he had a long, fluky tail. And he was just just something else is what that dog was. <laughs> he was something else. Hidden chest. Yeah, I gotcha. Oh, it's so hard to lose a pet. I don't think I've cried harder in my life than when I lost that dog. I I made. I've never heard those noises coming out of my body, crying. You know what I mean? Spirit, Spirit, your papa was real sweet, man. Your dog's real cute. I love dogs. But I black lab, you cross. Oh, right on. Raz. Oh, dude, you're, I love you, Nightwolf. I love your dog so much. I really do. I just like you're like you wouldn't like him. He's a jerk. And I'm like, no, you don't understand. I love animals where it's like you have to earn their love. <laughs> That's who I am. I'm like, oh, don't like me? We'll figure something out. We'll get there, buddy. We'll get there. I don't know. I just, it's just, it just means so much more when it's like you work your way there, right? I, I love, I love, I love animals that play hard to get. <laughs> Cats, dogs, burbs can read. Oh. And a white orange for a cat. It was my first and only foster. It was given to her foster home at four months. Oh. Respect animals who demand their love to be earned. I know, right? I think that's why he plays like cats. He's the world's snuggliest a-hole. Oh, dear God. Yeah, Pippa definitely falls under that category. Pippa definitely loves Dunk more than she loves me. I think she respects me more than she respects Dunk, but she, oh my god, she loves Dunk so much. She'll like wait for him at the door for him to come home too. She's like, oh, I know he comes home now. I'm, I'll just wait here, I guess. Better in December from the SBC. I'm so lucky to have found her. She's so good. Just tweaking the bad habits from someone else. Yeah, she looks like she's a good girl. I mean, the fact that she just chills while you're streaming is like amazing, dude. Yeah, she'll like often crawl up onto his chest and she'll she'll sprint. She's like, attention now. And she'll sprint to him <laughs> and crawl up on his chest. I'm like, 
kind of go like all bread and like her. She doesn't do that to me. <laughs> He's like, yes, I want love right now. She'll do it when I come home and if no one's been home for a long time. But yeah, she's she's a she's a daddy's girl. <laughs> Meanwhile, I can just walk in a room and pick him up and take him wherever I go. Oh my goodness. Yeah. She, she, she likes me. She respects me, but she's definitely like more affectionate with Duncan. That's okay. Big, big walks before stream. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, guys, can we get a big shout out for spirit music, by the way? Uh, Raz, if you don't mind. Fair music, fantastic content creator. Does a lot of acoustic live looping. Plays a lot of rock and classic rock and all sorts of fun funfetti songs in their stream. They basically play all the music on their own through the looping. They basically do like the drums, the beat, the rhythm, the chorus, the... Oh my god, what did I discover the other day? Oh my god, wait, did you see my Discord post, Spirit, about the only exception by Paramore? Oh, I was losing my mind, dude. You were doing the... You were doing the chord progression for um what is it called the wreck of edmund fitzgerald and the entire time i was like oh this is the same chord progression for like the only exception by paramore and i was like oh that's wild <laughs> i'm like how do i say it i'm like weirdly musically inclined i recognize patterns in music and sounds really really well um, and so, like, for me, I hear certain things and I'm just like, oh, no, it's this, too. Or or you could play, like, three notes and I'm like, it's this song. Like, I'm very inclined to patterns and sounds and pitch and notes. Um, but, yeah, so you're doing that and I was just like, I actually got really confused. Are you going to do that next stream? Wait, do you do you wait? Do you like that song? <laughs> Dude, I didn't know you're- are you into Paramore? <laughs> yeah, guys, seriously, check out uh, Spirit Music. He's doing a partner push right now. Fantastic Canadian content creator. I highly recommend y'all check him out. It's a, it's a good place to vibe and hang out. Wait, what do you mean you're doing next stream? What are you doing? I don't know what you're doing. What are you, what are you doing next stream? <laughs> okay. When I was younger, my daddy cried. First, that friend. A really good song. Broke his heart, and I watched. He tried to. I don't remember the lyrics anymore. Don't remember it. <laughs> I haven't listened to that song in a while, actually. Every song sounds the same to me until I hear it again. I blame my parents for having me watch Fantasia as a child and like listening to that classical like movie. And because of that, I'm so in tune with music and instruments and songs like like for me, um, especially like I think it actually helped me out with my memory too because I can I can watch like if if a classical song is played from Fantasia I can watch the whole scene from the movie in my head right Rain Man but with music <laughs> Tanner shut up I love Paramore too so wait what are you gonna do what are you gonna do next stream then I don't know what you're gonna do next stream you want to tell us <laughs> Oh, yeah. And I tried to watch as he tried to reassemble it. There you go. Those are the lyrics. Yeah, you said, you said, <laughs> you said in chat, guess what I'm going to do next stream? Question mark. Lol. What do you mean? What are you doing? Yes, you spirit. <laughs> you tease, you tease. Grigori. Hey, good to see you. Welcome. 
Have you seen The Sorcerer's Apprentice? I don't want to watch that. Because I do not like that part of Fantasia, Grigori. Thank you very much. That is, are you kidding me? That entire scene is a scene of nightmares, okay? Like you, bro, I swear to God, as a child, I had nightmares from that scene, okay? Goodness gracious. I, no, I don't need to see that. Mm -mm. No, no. Just, I'm not even joking. Listening to that song gives me some mild PTSD. Chef, thanks for the lurk. I appreciate you. Okay, do you guys know what happens in that scene, though, in Fantasia? The pink elephant music is made of nightmares, too. Absolutely. It's just like a- it's a fever dream. It's a fever dream. Is contemplating the Paramore song posted in Discord? It's a sweet song! It's really nice! Uh oh. We gotta throw car batteries into the ocean to appease the chimichanga volcano. What the fuck? Sorry. I didn't mean to swear. <laughs> <Night wolf. laughs> Chonga Volcano. No, I don't think we do. Actually, I really don't think we do. <laughs> God's sake, Nightwolf. Well, that was my one swear of the night. I hope you're happy. <laughs> so, for context to anyone's like, why was that funny? There's a volcano here, and it's called the uh... Chunchu Manchu Volcano, not the Chimichanga Volcano. And it gets very mad if you throw things into the ocean. Eels crave car batteries. <laughs> Anyways, you don't want to throw things into the ocean because it gets mad and it explodes, okay? It gets very mad. Oops. I want to change my username to Chimichanga Volcano. <laughs> That's a, a bit of a brand change from spirit music, don't you think? <laughs> I only remember Mickey's part. Okay, so basically, Mickey Mouse is the sorcerer's apprentice, and the sorcerer basically tells him, Hey, you're lower than me. Go sweep up the place. Go mop up the place. And Mickey Mouse did not want to mop. So instead, he knew a little bit of magic and he enchanted the mop slash broom to clean the floors themselves. Like he, they, they became animate, or at least one of them became animated, right? And it would like fill a bucket up and then it would like mop the floors and repeat. But the thing is, it was only like programmed to fill the buck up, bucket up, dump the bucket, mop and repeat. So eventually the place started flooding, right? And Mickey Mouse is like, oh my god, I'm gonna get in so much trouble. So he, 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 he orders, he tries to do magic to tell it to stop, and it doesn't, it keeps going. And so, to solve his problem, he chopped it up into a million and one pieces with an axe, violently. But it turns out, oh my god, I'm getting like, heebie jeebies just thinking about this. Instead of being destroyed, each and every one of the splinters of the broom mop that he destroyed reanimates into their own separate mop rooms. And then they all start grabbing water buckets and they all start flooding the whole place. And it's just like, oh my God, the music is so creepy. And there's like, there's like, there's like hundreds of them now all dumping water and all flooding the entire area. And it's just like, oh my God, oh my God. And the music just makes it like, very creepy. Very spooky. I I gen like I genuinely get like goosebumps when I hear that so song. I'm just like, ugh. <laughs> Spirit music of the volcano. That's actually That's actually not bad. Do 
<laughs> and then the sorceress comes back and he's like, what have you done? <laughs> he's like, this is stupid. What have you done? And promptly stops the whole thing. And he's just like Mickey Mouse. I swear to God. Yeah. Oh no, there's no fuel. Uh oh, I didn't realize there's no fuel. Uh oh. Delivery, fuel, all of it. Please order, yes. My child was robbed by the pike and sword and the stone from Disney. What is that? God, I love Fantasia so much. Fantasia is fun fact, guys. Fantasia is the main reason why I love dinosaurs. There is an entire... Uh oh There is an entire scene they do to the classical song, uh, Rite of Spring, where it shows, like, the planets and the evolution of Earth forming as a planet, the evolution of life from microbial organisms to um, fish to animals that come out onto land. Um, and then it shows like the earlier periods before the dinosaurs and the transitions into the dinosaurs. And it shows like kind of the, oh my God, I love the old school dinosaurs too. I love the tail dragging upright, like absolutely crazy looking dinosaurs, like in hindsight now, right? Cause we know they didn't look like that. Also, it's funny that they have the T-Rex and the Stegosaurus in the same scene because did you guys know that less time exists between the T-Rex and humans than there does between the T-Rex and the Stegosaurus. More time exists between when, when the Stegosaurus was alive on Earth and when the T-Rex was alive on Earth. Because the Stegosaurus is from the Jurassic period. T-Rex is from the Cretaceous period. But just the music and the sounds and then you see all the dinosaurs die and it's just like, I was like, I don't get it. Why are the dinosaurs dead? <laughs> As a kid, I was like, I love them. Why did they have to die? Stegosauruses were uh, earlier. Gotcha, Peter, gotcha. Ah, it's okay, Peter. <laughs> but I just love, like, the big, lumbering, fat dinosaurs in it, and just the, oh my god, just all of it is just like, I love old school dinosaurs. I, I love seeing how far we've come with science and understanding autonomy and uh, like musculature and how everything hooks up together and like physics and like just looking at these older dinosaurs now, it's like, oh my God, no, they wouldn't have functioned. They can't, they can't, have, they, you, a T-Rex can't like walk upright like that with his tail dragging behind it. Absolutely not. Oh, Nim, that would be amazing. Drumheller is fantastic. Yeah, it's great. I was supposed to end stream 20 minutes ago, but I really want to at least, whoop, level up before we wrap things up for tonight. Brontosauruses make me so happy. Brontosauruses do not make me happy. <laughs> Even as a kid with T-Rex, I was like, how, how, how does it hunt things that are, you know, on the ground when it's up there? <laughs> the scene, like the, the beginning scene? I was worried we'd be stranded. Do, 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 do. Buy some hat. What do we need? We need hat. We need drinks. We need, we need hats and drinks. That's all we need. Oh no, the fish! Go outside. Oh. Fishy, fishy, good boy. Um. Hats and fish. The hat.
and drink. Also, I totally forgot I actually have other shelving here too. Didn't I? Oh no, I haven't bought it yet. Big, big fat lie. Any bears? Any strays? Boys, here we go. No, trying. It's all good. It's all good. Also, there, there's the pastries. I think pastry stand. I personally like having this, like. Near the front, I think looks better. Yeah, here we go. Oh, okay, just those cookies. I think we can get to the next level. Outside Lego, City and Erupting Volcano has released a hidden lava crystal. Build the Volcano Crawler Drive into action and drill to reveal the precious crystal. The new Volcano Explorers collection from Lego City. Oh my god. Thank you so much for hanging out, friend. I really do appreciate you. I hope to see you sometime soon. You have yourself a lovely heckin' evening. We'll catch you later. And I don't know. Tangent, I don't get it either. My house is huge, but in the worst province in the country. You live in Manitoba? version of Matt where do you live what province are you if you don't mind Sherry you don't have to <laughs> I I would consider Saskatchewan better than Manitoba personally oh you're a Berta boy oh okay yeah I I well isn't wasn't Manitoba like isn't isn't Winnipeg like deemed the murder city in Canada? <laughs> Nim spirit music is in Saskatchewan, by the way. Guy looks very angry. <laughs> I made a really bad joke in a partnered streamer stream, and I don't think they get the joke about like how like Canadians just like poo poo on Quebec. Do you know what I mean? And so they're like, yeah, I'm an actor from Montreal. And I was like, oh, you're from Quebec. I'm like, OK, I'm out. And they're and they're like, oh, what's 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 wrong with Montreal? And I was like, it was a joke. It was a joke. It was a joke. <laughs> I don't have anything against it. <laughs> Yeah, it was just, it was, I was like, it's like funny because it's like, it's in Letterkenny, 
right? Like the people from Quebec. Awesome. <laughs> it's funny. And it was, yeah, no, they didn't find it. They, they I don't know. <laughs> Okay, what else can we purchase? We can purchase some more upgrades. Uh, car wash level two? Sure. Quebec? Quebec? Oh, really, Manfred? Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, dude, I, I, I say it ironically. I personally don't care from what part of Canada you're from. It, it doesn't matter to me. Bonjour, comment ça va? Vachement bien. I've actually never, I've never been to Quebec. I'm sure it's very nice. I would not be able to speak the language at all. Je parle un peu français. J'aime le pop tart. Oh, ha, ha, croissant. Voulez-vous coucher avec moi ce soir? Yes, that's that's all I can communicate in French. That'll get me pretty. I think I think at least one of those phrases will get me pretty far, though. <laughs> bad joke. That's a really bad joke. Oh, ha. yeah. Canada is a great pro uh, province. Oh my god. Canada is a great country. I love living here. It's nice. That is going to be your go to in France and French Canada. Wait, which? Fr oh, the croissant thing. <laughs> Omelette du fromage. Yes. Oh, Voodoo, hold on. Were we were we talking about this in Mana Stream earlier? We were, weren't we? Whoa. What my name means in France? Wait, what does your name mean? Oh, phonetically? Oh dear God. Oh, Voodoo, okay, sorry. There was someone else in Mana Stream who, um, as a US -ian. Oh, for some reason I read that as like Asian in, in, in the US. No, I get what you're saying now. <laughs> there was someone in Mana Stream who was Japanese, um, but they were born and raised in uh, the States, and we were like having a conversation about that. Oh. Fine, thanks for the lurk. I appreciate you. Nim, you're really lucky, by the way. The only reason you can say British Columbia, I'm pretty sure, is because there was a SnowRunner map that was in BC, by the way. That is the only reason that province is not a blacklisted word in here right now. Well, yeah, if I'm playing a SnowRunner map and it's in BC, right? Like, I can't, I can't blacklist the word because everybody's going to come into chat being like, How's BC? How's the British Columbian map? No, 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 right? <laughs> and I think, I think just since then, I haven't re-blacklisted that word. But that's the only reason why you've really been able to say that. <laughs> there was one person, I had B, like, the letter B and then C banned. And... <laughs> 
<laughs> there was one person who they instead of saying because they shortened it to bc in chat and they couldn't understand why they were getting moderated and why they couldn't type their sentences out <laughs> they were getting so frustrated and they're like i don't know why i can't say my stuff and it's <laughs> <laughs> and it's like, well, there's type to <laughs> Just type to a mod. What are you, <laughs> what are you saying? And they typed it. I think they typed it to Dunk and Dunk was like, oh my God. <laughs> whoa, 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 wait. <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> I had that situation in Spirit Music's stream actually the other day. I was like, Look, I'm getting moderated for this. And I'm like, what am I getting? I don't, I'm like, I don't even know what I'm getting moderated for. We figured it out. I'm like, after I said the same thing three times, I was like, oh, I know what the word is. <laughs> Which is fine. I totally respect that you want to moderate that word. And I, I totally understand why you would want to moderate it. <laughs> but it was, I was jamming good tunes. I was like, oh, no, it's okay. I'll just, like, not say that anymore. He's like, no, I'll remove that. And I'm like, or he, she, I, I don't, they, they, sorry. I just assumed. I don't actually know. Um, but I was like, <laughs> I, I, I don't know. It's fine. I can just, I can just not say that anymore. That's also, that's also an option. Hello. That and you are trying to copy paste the raid right call and getting moderated too. Uh, oh yeah, it was like for like repetitive something something messages. Would you like to see it? Why are you pulling that up, Tanner? Yeah, no, there's a reason. Yeah, usually when I explain the the province Canada thing, people are pretty understanding. Um. I've, I've not had a single person being like, wow, that's, that's, that's unacceptable. They're like, oh yeah, no, I get that. Ah, uh, that's fair. That's fair. That's totally fair. Okay, upgrades. What else can we upgrade? The warehouse. It doesn't look bigger to me. The volcano is happy. Yeah, I mean... The only way, especially if it's like a blacklisted word, like it's blacklisted on Twitch, the only way you're going to find that out is through DMing a mod because if you don't know what the word is, you can't ask like, which word is this? Because then you end up like <laughs> typing it in again. Oh, okay. So this connects to that. Oh, it's like kind of cute now. What the, oh, I'm cooking. Hi. Doesn't feel any bigger than it was before, though. But fine. That's fair, Voodoo. Yeah, at least in Spear Music Music Stream, I I when I got moderated, I'm like, ooh, I said two words in here that could have been it. I'm like, we'll figure that out later. And then I just happened to say the word again, one out of the two words again. I was like, ah, it's that one. It was that one? Fine. are a high rotation topic. Gotcha. Yeah, I think asking about, I mean, you can, the easiest way is just to DM a mod being like, hey, I typed this. It's like saying this is against moderation rules. Can you let me know? Roll off and on. I mean, I, I get why you would have that though. Like I, 
Ha I've had some people come in here and say some stuff that goes against our like no religion tool or tool, sorry, no religion rule. And it's like, no, oh, it's okay, great. Oh, okay. You're a lifesaver. Why is everyone resting? Why is no one working right now? Hi, you guys should be working. so weird that they're not working they're all resting right now that's so annoying no but they're not because he's working right now allegedly oh my god this is broken hold on guys i do want to at least go to the next garage level before we can stream here um but it looks like our helpers are are bugged so we're gonna just restart the game real quick here. The Chimichanga Volcano. <laughs> yeah, no, it's all good, Pooh. It's all good. I mean, it just, the DLC was just released today, Pooh. Just released today. Hey, Trison. I, yeah, because I heard the ba-ding, and I'm like. Warehouse level five. Go. Okay, we need to fuel 20 more boats. Cars. Serve six more customers at the shop. Here's That's doable. I think we can do that tonight, guys, reasonably, without me ruining my bedtime too much. Frank is in. Hey, how you doing? Good to see you. Guys, friendly reminder, make sure you're in the Discord. Because we're going to do a vote to see what game we play for tomorrow. If you guys do want to see some Stardew Valley, that is your opportunity. Oh, hold on. If you want to see some Stardew Valley, or if you don't want to see some Stardew Valley, that is your opportunity to voice your opinion. Uh. <laughs> hey, listen. Pooh. <laughs> Thanks for the follow. Dude, do you like Winnie the Pooh? Is that what your name was like named after, by the way? I got to ask. Contemplating the new Chimichanga Volcano song. <laughs> Dude, so wait, hold on, Spirit. You only recently added a uh, system of a down to your, like, song repertoire, by the way. I stink in junior high in the name Pooh. Really, really, hold on. Hold on. It really. Oh my god, I don't know if you guys heard that. Wait, can you hear that? Did that come through? I think that came through. Yeah, I, I get that, I get that. It's very quiet, I can turn it up. Hold on. Might be really loud, volume warning. That, that's actually too loud, sorry. Aeros has been up for about a year. The other one was added last week. Dude, I think, um... Oh my god, what was the song? Hypnotize. Are you familiar with Hypnotize? It's a slower song. I think it's totally doable. I think it's like... I think the... I think the lyrics are safe for stream. You know, as far as system as... <laughs> as far as system of a down goes. Um, Hypnotize is like... Uh, one of my favorite songs by them, too. It's pretty good. Thank you. Safe by... Ah! Yeah, no, I don't think there's any swearing or any, like, super lewd... Super lewd themes in it. No, well, I had to think about it because it's System of Down, not because of the song, Spirit. 
Minecraft. Okay, you, you're gonna be fussing here. You're gonna be fussing. You're gonna be giving me a hard time on my stream while I'm live right now. Here, hypnotize lyrics. System of a down. Jesus Christ. Uh, yeah, no, the lyrics are actually they're 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 pretty fun. Fussing. Fussing. <laughs> Yeah, no, it's it's pretty simple lyrics. Oh my god, he has such a great voice. Even their, uh, I can't remember what song they came out with recently that they released, but it's so good, and it's still so true to the band. It's so good. Blue Angels trailer? Like, like, like the... Blue Angels is Canada, right? Like the planes? Right? Or is that the States? Oh, I get so confused between the, the, the Canadians and the Americans. Oh, we have the snowbirds. Thank you. <laughs> I get so confused. Have a nice day. Thank you, chat, for clarifying. I appreciate you guys. Uh, but yeah, no, uh, Spirit, it's, uh, um, yeah, I will, I will say it's, it's definitely a political song. I, it's a song, it's a song that I, I support and I back and we don't really get into politics. We don't talk about politics here in my stream, but. It's a song that I really do like, and I would say I don't necessarily disagree with the political undertones of it. Um, does it have, like, naughty 18-plus themes in that song? No. <laughs> like, there are other songs. Um, but yeah, no, absolutely. Sorry, that that is that is the one thing about that song, where if you're not comfortable with, like, singing about that content matter, then yeah, that would be... Uh, we're talking about Hypnotize by System of a Down. Uh, I'm not sure which one it is, and I will. If it's one of the newly released songs that they had, though, I was like, oh, shoot, this is great. Yeah, that's awesome. I will. Thank you. I appreciate you. My chicken is much bigger than yours. What? <laughs> What's the context for that? No headbang emote? Do you want one? I'll make one. Paul, if you if you want one, I will make one. And you're gonna regret it. My chicken is much bigger than yours? I have never heard of that song. With word substitution. Okay. Underst understood. Thank you. Why would why would you regret it? Just what? What? Have I played the Deadly's Catch game? No, but I have played, um, uh, what is it? Fishing North Atlantic, which is kind of similar, not quite. There's like, there's even, I don't want you guys saying it in the chat, but there's even song names of like, there's like System of Down songs from like, I can't even necessarily like say their song name. It's in here. Ah. Okay. Yeah, terracotta pie. <laughs> banana, 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 terracotta, banana, terracotta, terracotta pie. Yeah, we don't. 
We're not gonna say that on stream, though. <laughs> Tryson instantly knew what song it was, too. <laughs> you can't! I've hired people! What do you mean? I've got... I've got... Hiroki? Who doesn't look like a Hiroki, but he's... he's doing that. I got someone else in the garage doing garage stuff, but I don't think they really are. I think it's actually Bug. I think it's actually Bug. What we're gonna do, guys, is we're gonna quickly save the game one more time. If this doesn't work, um, we might just have to wrap up stream. Probably. Well, we're gonna have to wrap up stream in, like, 15 minutes anyways, but... There's a couple of bugs in this game, and you kind of have to, like... Replay, like, restart the stream. Or not stream, sorry. Restart the game in order to, like fix things they're much worse than other albums too oh i don't know them what's the other song that i know it's like pogo stick by them uh reloading the save might work but i'd rather just restart the game gord thanks so much for hanging out i appreciate you i'm gonna shout out for is it called Bounce? <laughs> ah! Yeah, I meant that one. <laughs> Clear, clearly, I don't remember the name of the song. I'm gonna shout out for Gordon as we had. I appreciate that. Oh, God, we actually might have. Here we go. Thank you, Chili. I appreciate it. Gord, have a good one. Guys, check out Gord. He's fantastic. He's amazing. God, I'm gonna have to listen to some System of a Down after stream. Build in for the coast views and platforms. Bronco, hey, how you doing? Hey, he should be having people coming in here, so. Have you heard of Billy Talent? Do you want to get banned? What do you mean? <laughs> have you have you heard of Billy Talent? Who do you think you are? Who do you think you are coming here asking me if I know who Billy Talent is? Dude, shut up. No, it's all good, Spirit. Thanks for hanging out. I appreciate you. We'll catch you later. Uh, hopefully catch uh, one of your live streams sometime soon. See you later. Bye. It was a question. Do, uh, you've known me for how long you're asking me? You're asking me if I know who Billy Talent is? Are you kidding me? I'm like one of the most angstiest persons here on the, the platform. I live and breathe angst. Yes, I know Billy Talent. What do you what do you want? Bold claim. One of the, not the, one of the. Who's Billy Talent? Is he <laughs> Spirit Stop? You know who he is. <laughs> Spirit, get out! Alien Ant Farm? Yeah, they do a cover of um, Annie, Are You Okay? Is he talented? Dang. Oh, I don't even want to stream tonight. I'm not even, I don't even want to be here tonight. I don't even want to be here. This is a gas station? Correct. Oh, sorry. Are you saying that after I shot the shark with the cannonball? Is, is that, was that the context? <laughs> Tenacious D and Sona are spiritually similar? Uh, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. That... I see where you're going with that. But no. <laughs> I don't think so. I can see... I can see... Soda's just darker. You've never heard of Billy Talent? Oh, you like Voodoo? Do you like angsty music? Are you an angsty person? Are you a? It's not a phase, mom. It's a lifestyle type of person.
It's a lifestyle I can guarantee. I swear to God, if MCR tours, I'm going, I don't even care how much the tickets are. I am spending my life savings. I am remortgaging my place to go and watch My Chemical Romance. Are you kidding me? It's it's good video. It's good. They're good. If you if you were ever into angsty stuff, they're 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 good people. William Talent. How's the spray? Thanks for the follow. Welcome. William Talent. Is Billy Talent Can Canadian? I actually don't know. Maybe? I don't know. I actually don't know that. Oh, they are? Oh, sick. That. I knew who they were. I didn't know they were Canadian, though. Sorry. My bad. Nightwolf, get out! Go to bed, dude. Um, oh god, Star Fox, they are, but I just want to see My Chemical Romance. I don't want to see the other bands. Also, where is it playing? It's playing in a like, yucky place. It's playing in a part of the world I don't want to go to. Are they playing? Or isn't it in Las Vegas? <laughs> So, yeah, it's in Vegas. No, thank you. <laughs> I'm good, thanks. You said my name right? I can't believe some don't know how to say Astro. What did, what did they say? Looks in the which search bar and finds more streamers with Billy Talent in their name. <laughs> You've never heard these songs? Oh my god. Falling Leaves is good. And what's the other song? She reads the book from across the street, looking for someone that she'll never meet. Um. Talks over coffee for an hour or two. Joy's Wonders. Surrender, yes. Thank you. Oh my god, I'm like, I can't remember the name of the song. Uh, Surrender is really good too. Surrender is good. Surrender is probably my favorite song by them. All the boys give it great too. Uh, MCR is playing in a in a like a festival with a bunch of different like angsty bands. Astronaut, how you doing? Oh. Yeah, that guy's not the the car repair thing is like bugged, huh? You know, bring me to the horizon. That's a band, right? Maybe. This is another song that I know by Billy Talent. I can't remember. Surrender. Falling leaves, and there's another really good one. There's another one of their top songs. I can't remember the name of it. You have part of Kingdom of Giant? No. Somebody told me? No, I don't understand that song. I don't understand that song. I don't think anyone understands that song. Diamond on the landmine? No. Good night, Chili. We'll catch you later. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, div Devil in a Midnight Mass? You mean Mass? That's another one, but I swear to it, there, no, that's another good one. I swear there was another one, though. Not that one. You never really got into the emo scene. Bro, I told you, it's a lifestyle, not a phase, okay? And Veronica, oh, I'm gonna have to look this up now, hold on. Billy Talent. Pins and Needles? Uh, ooh, maybe? Maybe. Oh, Red Flag, dude! You kidding me? Nightwolf, Red Flag. Bro, what do you mean? Red flag? Try honesty? What do you mean? I meant those songs. 
What do you mean? <laughs> Dry honesty and red flag, dude. Yeah, those are their hits. What do you mean? I'm, I'm referring to their hits. Oh my god, I'm, I'm actually just gonna end stream right now. I, I'm done with this conversation. I'm done. I'm done. I'm over it. The game is also bugged, so I can't actually progress further right now. <laughs> you saying red flag? Yeah, red flag, dude. Oh my god, I'm done. Guys, thanks so much for hanging out. I appreciate you guys. Stay to enjoy the music chat. Just just yelling about Billy Talent Spirit. <laughs> My music taste is all over the place. I am like, I love angsty music. I love country. I love, I especially love classic rock. I love rock. I love pop. I love like 80s and 90s. It's stuff. And I'm just like, man. Anyways, I, I especially, I think I become very opinionated when it comes to, like, angsty music. I'm just like, bro, like, My Chemical Romance, Fall Out Boy, Billy Talent. Um, what was it? Theory of a Dead Man. Uh, oh my god. Oh, who's the, ba, 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 ba. who's the other band? Who does, they're like Theory of a Dead Man, but they're not. Three Days Grace. <laughs> I'm gonna get hate for saying that. <laughs> Green Day's good too. Green Day's good too. Escape the fate. Yeah, I've heard of them. Thanks for the screenshot. For do you mean the stream? Do you <laughs> Sakaro, do you mean the stream? What does that mean? <laughs> what the sh I'm done with streaming tonight. I'm done with all of you. Y'all need a timeout. Y'all need to y'all need to oh my god. Okay, we have some... <laughs> Lord, you just... <laughs> Sticaro! <laughs> Can you share it in the Discord? Yeah, Disturbed is great. Avenge... Oh, dude, I love Avenge Sevenfold. Uh, they're great. Papa Roach? Uh, I, I listen to them. I would not say they're great, though. Like, objectively, they're not great. <laughs> ah! To me, it rolls, like, okay, too, I guess. I don't know. Offspring! I love the Offspring, yes. Offspring's great. Audio Slave. Oh, you know what? Dunk is a huge fan of Audio Slave. Um, actually, you know what? Spirit music. You know what's really funny? Dunk's cousin is the drummer of a band that you probably actually do song requests for, by the way. Fun fact. Not saying what band, not saying what song, because, like, that's doxing, but... um. I've actually had to catch myself a few times when, like, it's been mentioned in chat. And I'm like, don't say it's Duncan's cousin! <laughs> Wanna know a funny Nirvana story? Okay, real quick, real quick. Is it Queen? Wonderwall? What? Uh, Evanescence? Uh, guys, we have a couple of places that we can go and visit tonight. Uh, we can visit someone who's playing Stardew Valley. We can visit someone who's playing Supermarket Simulator. Um. Quit the band because he thought this band isn't going anywhere and it was the band that was just before- Oh my- Bro. Oh my god, stop. No way. Astronaut, thanks for hanging out. I appreciate it. Dude, Evanescence is great. I think there was one day where we- we, um shuffled wake me up inside and like not on purpose i started singing like in the solo the girl parts and dunk started singing the guy parts and then i realized what we were doing and i was like stop i don't like this stop we're not doing this <laughs> is someone streaming gas station sim shut tanner shut up you know someone is streaming gas station sim okay guys what do you want supermarket simulator Stardew Valley gas station sim. What do you want? Yell it in chat. What would you guys like? We need to see supermarket sim. Do you really? Don't type numbers into chat. That does nothing for me. I want more good rates to go back down. Why are you talking? Like, yes, I agree with you. I 
would love Margot treats to go down, but why are you bringing that up now at the end of stream? <laughs> I mean, he's not wrong. He's not wrong. He's <laughs> Okay, anyways, um, that was the most accurate request ever. I'm like, dude, I feel that in my soul. Um, let's, guys, this is tough. We're gonna go raid into, uh, Salberry, who is also playing this game tonight. Uh, she's also playing Gas Station Simulator. You guys are gonna love her. She's amazing. She's fantastic. She is lovely. She's hilarious and so unapologetically herself. She's an experience. She's an absolute experience. You guys are going to love her. Um, we're going to go rate her. If you guys are subbed, you guys can type in that. If you guys are not, you can type in um, clean your clean your bum holes. If you guys are not subbed, you can type that in. If you guys are subbed, just do the regular sub call. Um, here's our Discord, by the way, guys. If you guys want to um, vote for the game that we play tomorrow, if it's Stardew or not, please let me know if you'd like to see it or not. Uh, as well as, uh, here's the YouTube channel, and the highlight channel, and the VODs channel. PP for your... <laughs> and then, additionally, here's my socials, if you want to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Patreon, Facebook, what have you. Yeah, I'm gonna try to stream tomorrow, guys. Staccaro, it is, yes. Vote for Stardew, or you'll get banned. That's not how that works. But guys, you're gonna love Sim. Please give her a very, very warm welcome. Um, <laughs> we'll catch you later. Have a good one. See ya.